don't know what I'm talking about. I'm out of Me my body neither. right now. I think. All right. 100 pesos. Uh, we're wait a second. We are, uh, we are heading to Applebee's. I'm worried about your sister. You, you think Tweak is working today? I'm fine. Hello. Welcome to Applebee's. Table for two, right this way. Oh, uh, actually, we're wondering if someone named Tweak is working today. He didn't show up for his shift, sorry. Do you still want a table? Um, you know what? You know what? Maybe this is a good spot to Hello, talk. Hello, Fawson. Uh, yes. I noticed we, we, your we will, title we doesn't say games and shit. Yet there is an impressive amount of shit on my screen. Also, I don't even see the games. Please clarify, Mr. Force. Also, my brother on the phone Enjoy wants to talk your with you. With you oh. Thank you. Oh. Bye bye. Okay, listen, I I'm sorry for making us sit here at Delay, Applebee's. Don't know. I know we're really focused on Lizzie, and that's kind of the important thing, but would you mind if I kind of got something off my chest here with you first? Sure. Whew, okay, thanks. You know, it's just, you know, it it's going to weigh me down if I don't say something. Okay, so you remember what happened on my home planet, Gatlas? It got taken over by the G3, like yours. You know, all my people got enslaved. Y y you remember that, right? You know all that, right? Sorry, of course sure. you do. Well, um, what if it was kind of, you know, just a little tiny bit entirely my fault? <sighs> okay, I, I can see you're at a loss for words. I, I, I know how it sounds. I'm not the only reason the G3 invaded Gatlas. I'm just the only reason they even knew about it in the first place. Hey there, welcome to Applebee's. I'm gonna be your waiter for the day. Can I get you started with one of our signature cocktails? Uh, not, not now, please. We're, we're kind of busy here. Uh, I'll have a Long Island iced tea. Okay, sure thing. I'm gonna go ahead and get that in for you. Uh, thank you. Okay, bounty hunter. So l l let me explain. Gatlas was isolated on the far edge of an asteroid belt. We were completely untouched by the greater interstellar civilization, j just like your planet. But you know, I I wanted out. Like I wanted to see the galaxy. I wanted to see what everything out there had to offer. That's when Rel Del Mar crashed his ship into our planet. He was this crazy smuggler. He, he'd been all over and he'd seen it all. And, 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 and after I helped him fix his ship, he wanted me to be a part of his crew, you know? And he, he took me with him. And I'm back. Here we go. This is for you. All right, now what were you thinking for an appetizer? Uh, I'm sorry. We're in the middle of something, please. Uh, I will have the... Hmm... I will have the chicken quesadillas. Great, it's, it's a safe right bet. Oh, I don't know why I picked Applebee's to tell you this, but wh where were we? Okay, oh, right. Um, Obviously, a guy like Rel, you know, he had to deal with all kinds of shady customers, and, well, you know, that led us to the G3. And Garmantuous, you know, he'd never seen an alien like me, you know, a talking gun with endless firepower. And, well, looking back, you know, I see how stupid I was, you know? I, I really do. But at the time, I couldn't tell. You know, I was being taken advantage of. I was going nowhere. You no, know, everyone thought I was a fuck up. You know, I, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I could do something. You know. Open up. Here comes the appetizer tray. Put in. Thank you. I ho hope you like those. Now you better be ready to order that main course. Um. Uh, yeah, of course. I will have. Oof. I think I go with the salmon. You betcha. I'm gonna get that order right to the cook. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you. So I led the G3 I don't need a lot of right fish, so I like to take the opportunity whenever I can. This? We fought them off at first, you know, but they came back with some super virus that damn near zombified everyone. You know, a few of us were immune. We formed a rebellion. It was led by Let's Do It. He was my best friend, my mentor. He was one of the strongest Gatlians who ever lived, and I, I got him killed. In his dying moments, I told him everything, like I'm telling you now, about how I left Gatlas to pal around with a criminal, how I led Garmantuous and the G3 right to our planet, how I got everyone killed, except Let's Do It survived. 
somehow. The G3 must have kept him alive to try to utilize his power. God, if we can really bring him back, do you, do you see my problem, right? Like, I, I'm gonna have to tell the other guns what I did. No, you don't. You know, or else he'll tell them. All right, I'm back. Hope those tummies are ready for some yummies. Bon appetit. Dude, take a fucking hint. Can't you see we're in the middle of a thing here? Emotional thing. Uh, you know, this is important baggage shit we're dealing with here. Take a hint and get out of here for a second. Uh-oh, someone's feeling grumpy. Because it didn't order oh, any appetizers. Now, what the fuck is happening outside? Lizzie? Don't follow us. Twig and I are in love, and we're going to travel the galaxy in his space RV. Uh, actually, this is moving kind of fast. Not Help me, please. that sentence. We're in okay, love. We gotta get to them. So, are we splitting the bill, or... I don't know. It's year 3000 oh, yeah. or something. I can't dine and dash. I love this place. Don't want to get blacklisted. 34 pesos. That was cheap. Oh fuck, okay, this, this this changes shit, this is bad. Are you alive in downtown Glim City where, as you can see, by violent and agitated G3 cartel forces. No one can say for sure why they're here. We're here to kill you, bounty hunter! I can't switch any weapons. Oh okay. shit, I only have this weapon now because I left the others at Oh shit. Oh shit. Get back home. Ah, I don't wanna die! I've got Stop shooting. It really worked, so... Man, I'm not in fucking... Made some new commercials with you in them. Oh, you don't just die if you... Just drum up more business and, well... Let's just say they had your house address. Well, the G3 knows where we are, so they're attacking the house. So... I'm coming yeah, home. Course, coming me. home. What are you doing? My bad. We gotta get to the house. That's the fuck I'm doing. It says this way. Alright, we're fine. Come on, come on, keep Broken up the pace! Still here. See you later. We have to get back to the house! That's right, let's go, we're gonna hurry! Oh yeah, I've been here the whole time, but, but don't worry, I'll keep your secret safe. I'm, I'm not a snitch. Oh shit. He knows. Snitches get stitches, though. So no time to talk. Holy shit, they're fucking everywhere! Surprise to see me, bounty hunter! I don't even see you at all. It's all over. Hand over the galleons you stole from us, and then let me kill you. Special people who are very worried about you. <laughs> turn, your, turn yourself in and nobody has to get hurt. Fuck, it we sounds like he's got your parents. Thanks for coming back for me. Yeah, I sure. Didn't deserve you. It's not your fault. Well, no, you don't fuck that. It is your fault. You fucked up enormously, but we'll deal with that later. Please fire up the warp core. We're leaving. Got it. Hey, don't forget about us. Yeah, yeah. What's the plan? Yeah. I'll handle that. Can you pull off a Hennison maneuver mid warp to juke them? Can I what? Did you make that up? You mean scramble the warp? Fine, yes, scramble the warp. Bounty hunter, bring me to the warp core. Oh. What? Activate the warp core? 
Okay, look, okay, I, look, I try not to be too critical. I, I, I'm, I'm a pretty go-with-the-flow kind of character, but you need to get to the fucking house fucking now, your house! I am at the fucking house, you bugged out piece of shit game! Maybe trying to enter the Wi-Fi password instead of changing it. Uh. Maybe 230, but I don't want to die yet. Are we? Did did we make it? Yeah, we're safe. Nobody on our tail. But uh, where are we? Am I missing something? I'm not one picking second. up any signs of life out there. Then we're in the right spot. Kenny, where did you just take us? It was the only safe place I could think of. Careful, it's toxic out there. I set up an atmos bubble so you can breathe. So don't wander too far, or do. What does it matter anymore? See what's outside. Alright. Let's touch some fucking grass. Oh, shit. Welcome to Gatlas, my home planet. Jesus. I didn't realize it was this bad. Fuck, there's nothing left. This was our home? Pretty soon Earth is gonna look like this too. We have got to stop the G3. Bitch! Sorry, nobody answered me. I asked if this was our home. Anyone? How is it out there? Okay, we, we, we don't want to talk bad. About that bad, huh? Well, uh, don't get all depressed about it. We still got more guys out there to kill. Let's powwow real quick. What the fuck does that mean? Powwow? Look, I hate to be pushy, but are you ready for your next bounty? Uh, you know what, kid? Maybe you should get some rest. Let's save the bounty hunting for tomorrow. Head on upstairs. Bro, bipolar I'll the take game. Care of things down here. I hate to say it, but Gene's right. Let's get some shut eye. We'll make this right starting tomorrow. So this is your bedroom, huh? It's fine. I mean, I don't, I don't, you I don't, I don't have really been here before, expected, you know. All right. Good night. What? Was there a movie? All right, you're finally up. Okay, let's get back to it, I guess, you know? I, I, I hope Gene has a lead on Lizzie. Let's go. Yeah, look who finally decided to wake up. You know how late it is? Because I don't. There's no sun on this dead rock of a planet. Third movie? By the way, I got you a little sum sum. A new suit upgrade. Extra. Vampire bullshit. hookers. You're welcome. Well, he fucking turn it off. Let's get to business. I've got something you like. All right. You can breathe easy. I'll get right to it. 
I tracked down Lizzie's bio signal. Oh, that's great. So, so she's... She's alive. Don't worry. But she's on the move. Probably on a ship, so we have to act fast or we'll lose her. If you're ready, just step through the portal door. I'm ready. I don't know what I want. Okay, fine, I don't know either. Isn't the sex good? I don't know. I can't even tell if we're doing it right. We're aliens. None of our shit even lines up correctly. You could be pregnant and I would fucking wonder how that happened. My cum goes all over outside of your body. Well, okay. I don't know if it's good either. Your body is really confusing. God, I'm just so confused. Aren't we in love? You're asking me that, dude. You're the one who dragged me out on this trip. I wasn't looking for anything serious. I just wanted to get laid. But even that turned out to be some weird fucking Hellraiser puzzle. Oh, shut up. Don't blame this on me. There's plenty of ways you could have figured out how to use my equipment, so to speak. Hey, uh, sorry to interrupt. Oh, yeah, thank God. You came just in time to save me. Me is who you came to save. Thank you. Fuck your sister, dude. Woo. Cuckoo! Girls, am I right? Love is tough. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I don't know. We're a little worried about you. God, everyone needs to chill out. When have you smoked? What, you're a smoker now? Wait, what is it? Camels? Marble? 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 Marbleos? Marble? Marble? Marbleos? Marbleos? I don't know. What's it to you? What do you want? Sound uh, like you and Twig are having trouble. Uh, no shit. Yeah, we're yelling at each other. You want a fucking medal for being able to figure out when two people are fighting? Okay, Einstein. Hey, you want us to throw you a parade or something for figuring out the most obvious shit? Okay, honestly, now it seems like the two of you are getting along. Yeah, that's the problem. Sometimes we're happy together. Yeah, if we just hated each other all the time, fucking, I wouldn't be here. And you'd be playing some rock star game, you fucking asshole. <laughs> but we love each other. <laughs> what? I don't know. I, I thought this would help. Just us getting away together. My old life's fucked. Everyone else is doing their own thing. I just wanted... I wanted to bang someone on a rocket Winnebago in space. So sue me. Me too, Lizzie. Your body terrifies me in every way imaginable, but... Yeah, me too. <clears throat> what? Oh yeah? How? Uh... We should stay together. Yeah, how about you just let me handle this on my own? You already decided to become a weird alien killing expert. Don't strain yourself trying to be a dating expert, too. Um, yeah, no offense, but you're kind of butting in, dweeb. Hey, only I can talk to them that way. And look, I'm sorry I dragged you out here. Really, I am. I know you didn't want to. I, I just I wanted to know for sure if, Again, if we worked or not. My sister. Yeah, it's cool. I forgive you. I just think... Oh. Oh, really? Even after forcing you to leave with me? Yeah. Okay, it's Don't fine, snap. yeah. Don't Did you snap. know I almost sold you out to the G3? They were offering, like, a lot of pesos to find out where you were. And that would have been way worse. What the fuck, Twig? You piece of shit. Wait, what? Y y you're joking, right? No, I really almost did it. Like, I had my phone out and everything. If Lizzie hadn't dragged me on this trip, I probably would have. I'm not good. I'm a shithead. Lizzie shouldn't be dating me. Gene was right. And it's a little fucked up because he was being a misogynist, but he was actually right. I do suck, and I'm fine with it. That's just who I am, and I love it. So fuck off. Love it. Sue me if you don't like it. But good luck finding a judge who'll take that case. Or a lawyer. Fuck it. You're a fucking idiot. Well, Jesus. I was about to do a, a whole thing about how we should take a step back and slow things down. But you know what? Fuck you, Tweak. Yeah, d yeah, Tweak. Fuck you. Hey, thanks for coming to get me. Seriously. It, it means a lot. Uh, okay, enough. Let's go. You got it. Smell you later, Tweak. Later, Tweak.
Hasta la vista. We're back. You're safe. Uh, I mean, fuck you. And a fuck you too. Okay, happy reunion. Everyone's fine. Can, can we just get back to bounty hunting? Yeah, 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 yeah. Club just sent over the data on Nipulon, so you can head out while I fix Les to it. Did you, uh, know how much firepower this guy's packing? He's got to be at least ten times as powerful as any of you other Gatlians. Wait, you really think you're going to be able to fix him? Yeah. Yeah, I'll probably have them all patched up by the time you get back. You're serious? That, that, that soon? Yeah. Don't worry about it, kid. Your friend's going to be just fine. Old Papa Jean watched a bunch of GooTube tutorials, and now he knows his way around cybernetics. That's, that's, that's great. It's, it's just... What? You don't sound too happy. You know how hard I've been working to save this guy? Fuck. Whew, okay. I guess it's now or never, Bounty Hunter. Can you set the other guns down on the table for me, real quick? Hey, everybody. I, I, I need to come clean about... Uh, well, this is way tougher than I thought. Spit it out! Yeah, spit it out! No, I, I, I can't. I, you're gonna hate me. Dad, th we, we don't have secrets. We're a family! Well, hold on. I might decide to hate him. It's okay, Kenny. You can tell us. Oh, just fucking say it. Okay, fine. If you don't hear it from me, you're just gonna hear it from Les Dewitt when he wakes up. Okay, what if I were to tell you that I'm the reason the G3 invaded Gatlas and enslaved our race? We'll be mad. I, I don't think I could get over it. Yeah, don't say that. You know what? It would really suck to hear you say Kenny, that. Kenny, come on. That's not true, right? No, no, no. That would be impossible. Are you doing a bit? Okay, well, there's, there's more to the story than just oh, a... Fuck, he's scrambling for words. It really is true. He really did cause the downfall of our civilization. Kenny, how? That doesn't even make sense. How can it be your fault? I left Gatlas before the G3 invaded. But, but how could that be possible? We didn't even have interstellar travel on Gatlas yet. I ran into an alien smuggler who crashed his ship on our planet, and I was going nowhere. And, and, and he took me with him on these adventures, and it was supposed to be, you know, this fun, awesome thing. And But then we got mixed up doing the wrong job with the wrong crowd. Garmantuous and the G3, and I accidentally led them right to Gatlas. It all happened so fast, I, I thought they killed Les Do It. I, I told him everything as I watched the light leave his eyes. I didn't know he I didn't know he was gonna survive. You mean you didn't think you'd ever have Rick. to tell us the truth? No, 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 that's not it. I, I <sighs> This is all sorts of fucked up, Kenny. I don't even know what to say. See? I'm not the biggest fuck up here. Not now, dude. Everyone, please! I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I, I didn't know what I was doing. We're so close to taking down the G3. Let's just Oh, okay. Let's just pretend you're not the reason everyone we know and love is dead, yeah? Sure! Easy! Done! What's next on the agenda? Forgive Garmantuous too? Come on, th 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 that's not fair! Don't fight! I'm sure we can all figure this out! No, Creature! He can't just drop that bomb on us and expect everything to be the same! I I'm sorry! Look, I hate to be this guy, but we're running out of time. Nipulon may not stay where he is for long, so I know things aren't... The ideal, but uh, yeah, 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 yeah. We'll finish the job. And then you're out of our lives, Kenny. Come on, Sweezy, you don't mean that. Enough. Just pull yourselves together for this mission, at least. You're professionals. You're bounty hunters. Act like it. Mm hmm Fine. <laughs> okay, yeah. Gather everyone up. It's time to get back on track. Nipulon just flew back into his drug lounge on Port Tarine, so we gotta strike now. Can you handle that? She meanwhile with strawberry lips controlled. Let's just get this over with. Writhing on burning coals. Is it start now? On my lips. And I can roll to Is this part one? Conscience in my couches deep. I am so Vampire hookers? That when men I crush to my dreaded... Don't you have something better to do than stand around blocking the TV all day? I bust. So frail. So bold. So shy. And so robust that impotent angels damn themselves for me. Vampire hookers. That sounds uh, scary. Filmed by Sirio H. Santiago. Alright, let's see what you got, Sergio H. Santiago. Fair bear.
my life. Is that Nicholas Cage? Having a girl in every port, and this is the first port I've seen. No. You know, I don't think you know what to do if you got your hands on a girl. I'd know enough to get more than my hands on her. <laughs> By the time you figured it out, she'd be more worked over than a two-dollar hooker at a Shriners convention. Ooh, I can handle it. I know. You've been handling it all the way from San Francisco. And you'll be dreaming about it all the way back to San Francisco. Why don't we just stow these bags in the barracks and uh, hit the town? I'm with you. Okay. Man, are we lucky to be stationed here? Yes, we are. Would you look at this place? It's fantastic. You know, this is the Paris of the Orient. I bet you can find anything you wanted on this street, just like Eddie said. Bet he said it. You can bet your bottom dollar on it being here. Oh, yeah, Chief wouldn't steer us wrong, man. Nope. Nope. You know, that old salt's looking out for us. That is? Uh, somebody has to. Huh? Hey, Chief! Hey, Eddie! How did you get down here so fast? I just happen to know the right people. Julio here is the best damn cab driver in this city. Julio, this is Tom Buckley and Terry Wayne. Hi, fellas. Listen. You guys need anything around town while you're here? Anything at all? Just, oh, just ask me and Julio can find it for you. If Julio can't find it, it can't be found. Now, listen, I know everybody around here and they know me around here, so if you need anything, just ask. But don't ask now. We have to shove off. Where are you off to? Oh, we got some important business to uh, take care of. Oh, yeah, what's her name? And does she have a sister, huh? Later, fellas. Later. Let's go, Julio. See you later, Eddie. Take it easy. Can you believe that? He's already got something set up. Well, there's nothing to worry about. We're gonna have something set up, too. Faster than a cat can lick its ass. I know how to find women. Is that right? That's right. Then why are we standing over here when all the girls are over there? <laughs> this is gonna be easier than falling in a creek. And a whole hell of a lot more fun. Uh... How safe is this one? It's on YouTube. It's an egg. Oh, you strong in bed. Oh, oh well, yeah. 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 I'm a try some of this again, yeah. yeah. What you do, just crack it on the table? Oh, hey, no, 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 no. Huh? You don't do it that way. What? We do it this way. How do you do it? Look for the big end, uh -huh. see? And just crack it a little. Uh-huh. Then fill it. Yeah. You can see inside, there's some water on it. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. And then you put some little salt. A little salt? Uh-huh. Uh -huh. And then you sip the water. Sip the water? Yeah. Tastes good, huh? Not bad. Why don't you try it? Hmm? No, no, no. Then what do you do? Feel it, you know. All Feel it. The rest of the way. Huh? All rest of the way. Uh huh. Feel it on off here. Mm hmm. Just a little bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put some so add some salt again. More salt. More salt. Huh? Yeah. No, no. Just for seasoning and all that. Mm hmm. Yeah, okay. okay. And eat it. Eat it. All the way. Eat it. Mm -hmm. Piece, huh? No, the whole thing. Whole thing? Yeah, swallow it all. Just put the whole thing. Oh, yeah, just, well, yeah. Wow. Yeah, right. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> balloon. What is what is balloon? Testicle. What? What did he say? It's good. You mean like quack quack? 
Yeah, I know he made him touch her balls. I know, but why were all the other girls or yeah, going <laughs> attacking them in a weird way? The only thing I was gonna say is if the first oldest rule in the book doesn't work out, all you do is turn to the second oldest rule in the book. Yeah, what's that? Want to date? Meet the second oldest rule in the book. Hi, darling. How you doing tonight, honey? Oh, sweetie Hello. pie, how are you? Oh, yeah, this looks like a real thing. Yeah, I think this is the real thing. Uh-huh. All right. Here we go. This way? You wait here. We tell our friends we need your apartment. Told you I'd get us some action, huh? Scum us. Oh shit. Everyone in Thailand knows Kung Fu. San Francisco bar. Is that the bar with all the... <laughs> Question: Do I get asked the most? Yeah. Can you drink the water? Sure, sure you can drink the water. You can also drink the rum. <laughs> we should get your bundle out quicker than the. Wow, this is such a normal movie for me, a human. This is the sort of thing I enjoy watching. That wasn't this me. That was just really, really well timed. Vampires. Just kidding. This is so fucked up. You don't have to watch this. I don't blame you. Human movies are evil. You should go do something else. But if you want to keep watching for some reason, we'll still be here after the break with more Ad break. vampire hookers. Roko, transparent doctor, Nintendo Dolphin dude, Manon, a turbo preserka, final piss on Trump W's dance game, Rave, and Zagon Lol. Thank you boys, welcome back, welcome. Oh, I think it's uh it's bugged. Alright. We're gonna have to wait for uh, part two. This usually works. <laughs> Nipulon! Uh, G3 Chief of Customers Liaison is a German second in command. He's one of the most feared members of the G3. He had over this illegal drug launch in Brazil. Okay. Hey, in the event that I manage to get Les Dwit back online, we'll be ready to fight Garmantuous. And for that, you're really gonna need those Earth coordinates. Nipulon should have them logged somewhere in his office, in that big drug lounge he runs. Find those if you can, so we can take the fight to Garmantuous back on your home planet and finish this. True. Remember the coordinates. Okay, we just need to sneak into Nipulon's lounge. Let's try... Can it, traitor? We'll handle this one. We don't want you selling us out. Kitty, do us all a favor and sit this one out. Hey, stop fighting! I hate it when everyone's fighting! We need to talk things over in a healthy way. No, 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 no. We just need to cover ourselves in goop again. It's not complicated. That's true. We should do that. 
but I also think we need to have a really fun time at the saloon, so go there first, please. <sighs> Whatever, it's it's up to you, Bounty Hunter. Head over to Dregtown and get gooped up, or try hashing this out at the saloon. Talk things over in the saloon. Is this the saloon? Where's the saloon? Get ready to find some local critters. Where is the fucking saloon? It shows me it's here, but it's not. Oops. Oh, it's like okay. In the gray. Hey, it's me, the goop guy. I'm over here now. I moved here for your convenience. Hey, we are here for your services. We would like to get gooped again if you if if you could. Oh, no can do, partner. See my little gooper trooper, you're as sick as can be. Looks like he's not gonna make it. Truth be told, I don't think I'll ever be gooping anybody ever again. <laughs> Unless we get him that medicine. Medicine? Well, maybe we can help. Oh, no way. Thank you so much. Wow, that's so nice of you. There's a special flower over there in uh, the other side of Terrine Ravine. But good luck getting over there, because that ravine is Terrine through the valley, if you know what I mean. Those damn Mac and Cheese brothers are taking forever to build the bridge. I mean, if you could get them to do their jobs, then maybe we could get the flower and save my little Goopa. Don't worry, we, we, we got it. We could do it. Well, shit. I don't right. get my hopes up, but thank you so much. Hey, I know you those guys. See my impression? Huh? Um, um, can, can, can you stop by the G3 headquarters real quick so so I can sell out all my friends? Uh, Kenny's still our friend. No, it's fine. Let him go nuts. Wait, I can do one too. Oh, uh, nobody loves me, and I, I suck. I, I'm a piece of shit. A big dumb sicko who loves getting everyone killed. Well, Here's mine! Well, my name's Kenny, uh, oh, I'm sorry for what I did, I, I love you all very much, and I'll, I'll never do anything bad again, ever! Great work, everybody, I hope you, hope you got it all out of your system. Fuck! Fuck. Huh. So oh going God. straight is worse than going up. Okay. No, no, I just want to know how their mechanic works. Min maxing at its finest. Welcome back. Hello. Hey, man. What's up? Listen, I'm Jackie Mac and Cheese. L let me let you in on a little secret. This bridge ain't never getting fixed. You know, if we fix it, we're out of a job, so, you know, we're taking our sweet time, you know? Well, I guess we're not gonna be friends. Bye-bye. Um... Where are those workers? This is this marker is so bugged. Where are the fucking workers? Yo. In town? Who the fuck are these guys? Oh jeez, alright, bye. Halsey. Oh, they're over there, maybe. Okay, see you later then. I don't understand where the fucking saloon is, man. Look at this! Uh, 
It's very unclear, I'm gonna be honest. In town? Yeah, and then the market just shows me back and forth, back and forth. Where? Okay, there. Go there. 35. Look at this. 15. I'm here. Now go there. Alright, I'm here. Now what? Go here. Okay, I think we're going to the saloon now. Actually, finally. Very good. Here it is. Yeah, go ahead. What's up, Mark? Actually, here this. I just wish we could build some windows out here. You... Hey, 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 whoa, whoa, Buster! What are you doing walking on? This is a live construction site. Very dangerous. You can't hang around here unless you're a construction professional. Okay, so you're not leaving, are you? You're just fucking barging in. What do you want from us? Hey, we're, we're just trying to look for a way across. Well, tough luck. You, you, you think you own the world? You want to get across the ravine? You gotta wait for us, Mac and Cheese Brothers, brothers, to do our work. Yeah. Yep. Come on. You're telling me there's nothing we can do? No. Sorry, pal. Listen. We got our own emotional shit right now, you know, we're, we're on strike until Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers, you know, he comes back from that goddamn saloon in Old Town and he tells us he loves us Mac and Cheese Brothers, his sons. You, you want us to get your dad to love you? Alright, listen, we just need to hear that he loves us, that's it. We ain't working until we find out, okay? Alright. Hey, we're the Mac and Cheese Brothers, yeah, you can't do shit, you're, you're a piece of shit. Fuck you. Fuck you. Uh, sorry, does anyone know where we can find, uh, Papa Mac and Cheese? I mean, it should be yellow, right? This looks like him. Hello, I'm sorry, we're trying to find a Papa Mac and Cheese. You might may, may be able to point us in the right direction? Hey, you that? Yeah? I'll tell you what Papa Mac and Cheese is, if you do this guy. What? No, no, I mean, please pick anybody but me, please. Well, huh? A duel? Okay, okay. Well, you know what, listen, whatever, we'll do it. Here are the rules. Stand five feet apart, count to three, then draw. Last man standing wins the fucking duel. Come on, man. I, I don't want to do this. Come on, it'll be fucking fight. Go on, then. Get to your mark. All right. Uh. Perfect. Here we go, then. Jeez. I'll count you down. Shoot at each other on fucking draw, all right? Three. All right, we got this. Two. I believe in you. I think. One. Fucking draw. Four. That's some quick trigger finger you got there, fuckface. Oh, th fuck thank face. you. Fuckface? I say is, fuckface is all the time. Okay? Oh yeah, he's dead, but it's fine. We, hate we have him. so much in common, kid. Rick and anyway, Morty creator. Sorry about all that. I was just fucking with you. It's fun to do a whole Big Ten shootout thing, you know? Yeah, we love it. Anyway, I'm Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers. What can I do you for? Oh, uh, we met your kids over at the construction site. Oh, is that so? Yeah. And how are those good-for-nothing pieces of shit doing? They just sent us here to get the confirmation that you love them. That's it. But I hate them. They're shit heels. They ain't fit for the Mac and Cheese Brothers name. Wait, are you... What? Are, you, you don't really want us to tell them that. Yeah. Tell them I said I hate them, and I hope they all fucking die. Now leave me the fuck alone. Uh, okay. I guess that's that then. You are... You're a tough guy, Papa Mac and Cheese Brothers. Watch it! I'm not changing my mind. Seriously, you gotta fucking lead now. Okay. We can just make some shit up. I'm gonna take this one. Oh, look who's back. Hey, so what, what, what did Papa say? Huh? Does he love us or not? Uh Listen, I'm sorry, but he 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 wouldn't say that he he loves you. He, he wouldn't say it. Oh fuck him. God, of course typical piece of shit asshole dead be dead. You know what? We don't need him. We never did. You gave us the power to love ourselves. Actually, no, no, fuck that. It's not true. I'm lying. We we need our dad. We need a papa. We need him so bad. I love my dad so much. Even if he hates me, I love him with all my heart. I'm bleeding over, overflowing with love, and I don't care who knows it. It's it, it's a curse to keep loving him, such a shitty, heartless father. But I'm I'm, I'm, I'm I'm bursting with love. I'm bursting with love. Oh my god! Oh, I'm like a fucking bomb. Yeah. It's exploding with love for my papa. Oh, I'm like a fucking bomb. What? what is it? Oh my god! What's going on? What is that thing that's appearing? Holy shit! Is that from the love that's happening? Oh my god! Holy shit! 
I'm like a fucking, I'm like ejaculating if, the, if you know what that ya. means. Jesus, these guys need therapy. You tell but me. hey, looks like we can cross oh, now, oh, though. Figured it out. Oh, look at me, the bridge of love. You gotta be kidding me. The bridge of love. Alright, we did it. Let's get this back to the goop salesman and fix up his gooper. What's in here? A one warp crystal. Hey, thanks for coming to get me. You're welcome. I know things are crazy right now, so I'm uh, glad I still have family. Like you to to that to make to any sense. Uh, Sorry if I'm a little distracted. I, I've, I've, I've got a lot on my mind. You know, like all my friends blaming me for genocide. What the fuck? I know we're not doing this just for fun, but it is, it's fun! It is! I got you a flower. Wow, you did it! This will save my little Koopa's life! Thank you so much! It was no problem. But actually, no, it was, it was really tough. Uh, but you're welcome, you know? Uh, yeah. Okay! Oh my god! As good as new! You really saved his life! I don't know how I could ever repay you! Looks the oh, same, dude. Oh, that's right! He could shit his goop all over you! work just to get covered in the shit again. Wow, you look great. Real goopy, real shitty. Alright, uh it's this way, right? Or is there a shortcut with the guy with the pipe? Oh shit, okay, G3, don't forget, we're in disguise, we don't have to fight. Wow, well, look at that stamina, you, you must have been on track team or something. What? I can't take it. Uh, sorry to be a dick, I just think I w already watched everything on TV, so I'm hoping something interesting happens outside and I'm losing hope. You watched Vampire Hookers without me? What's in there? Dude, what the hell, dude? Can't believe he's done this. Haha, <laughs> a properly gooped G3 minion. You must be here for your one free spa day. What? Please enjoy your stay. It's working. Uh, sure. Which. Entrance. Oh. Alright, is this the uh, alien nightclub? Hello, esteemed G3 minion. Thank you for redeeming your one time only free spa day. Spa Please day. Continue forward. Uh, oh, thank you. Alright, uh, I'm just gonna cut in line because I'm like a soldier or something. Alright. No ticket needed, I guess. Okay, this is going well. Just gotta keep our cool and sneak our way through. We keep coming, motherfucker. Phrasing. What? Huh? Ah, 
aghast. Please allow me to show you to a private booth right this way. Let's just play along. They might lead us right to Nipulon. Uh. We do hope you'll find your time here satisfactory. Remember, we're here to cater to your every need. You name a drug, we have it. Zero G, Fergals, and yes, we're now serving every type of human. We've got young teenagers if you're looking for something big, or perhaps you'll prefer the gentle high of an elder human years away from death. Please, don't stray. Come on. There will be plenty of time to relax once we get you set up with a nice batch of humans. Humans, ooh, you What the good. fuck? What the fuck? a good time everyone is having yeah 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 your boot is just past here holy shit hey you gotta try this human shit these dumb fuckers get you so high i had a baby one a couple hours ago and i swear i can't even remember my own name right now god i wish they lasted a little longer he would suck his humans dry way too fast, but they hit so good. Waiter, bring me six more humans. More babies if you got them. I like them best young and innocent. What the fuck? Please, I need your help. Ah. Uh. I can't help you now. You're keeping me in a cage. And now, <laughs> please follow me to your booth. Hey, waiter, can I get a few more humans when I get a chance? Of course, sir. I hope you don't mind sharing your booth with another guest. We're a bit overbooked today. Sorry. Yeah, you ever try human? This shit's amazing. Oh, yeah. Look how dumb they look. All hairy and weak. No lucky they can't be so fucking high. Otherwise, they'd be a waste of the species. Oh, fuck. I love seeing the light leave their eyes. Yeah, fuck this. Do what you have to do. What's wrong? Why you give me that look? What, you don't want me talking about humans like that or something? You know they're just drugs, right? It's not like their feelings even matter. Go for it, bounty hunter. Just, just fucking do it. Why you look so pissed? You need to unwind a bit, pal. Just order some humans for yourself and have a good time. All right, that's it. You're freaking me out. I'm calling security. Hey, waiter! I got you. Galaxy's goofiest gifts, home and hive magazine, one of the leading lifestyle magazine for atrophodes. Uh, don't you think you can't enjoy it if you get a vertebrate? Uh, learn how to turn agreeable. Learn how to turn agreeable into a stew or use hologroid scale up climbing up your. Uh, I was just talking to think maybe you didn't like me or something. Let's do this shit. <laughs>
redemption. Maybe I really am a permanent fuck up, you know? A waste of life, a meandering soul. Wouldn't that be depressing? Well, you should have done that. Surveil this! That uh, really hurt, Charlie. Hey, uh, don't put me back in the holster with the other guns. They keep doing mean impressions of me. Well, creature's impression isn't mean. It's it's actually kind of sweet. You ready, bounty hunter? Am I? Uh, you're still on my side, bounty hunter. There you are. Safe now, man. Or girls, or all right. Is that all she wrote? I think so. Welcome, bounty hunter. <laughs> Not you Talon. again. <laughs> Can I just call you BH? <laughs> I won't. Nipulon will see you shortly. Just you know. Can I get you anything? Helen, well, what are you doing here? Yep, you keep killing all my bosses, so I have to keep finding new ones to work for. <laughs> Why don't you take a seat for a moment? Uh, all right, I'll just sit down here. I'm trying to find batteries for the TV Good remote. idea, let's rest those legs. We got, we got something coming up here. Save Earth so we can fix the TV remote. So, uh, how much longer do we have to wait? Any minute now. We appreciate your patience, thoughts, and prayers. Hey, Kenny, right. you want to skip the boss fight and just give ourselves up to Nipulon? Let him kill your friends for old time's sake? Great, just what I needed. Some more time to sit and feel like shit. Uh, uh, you do understand why we're mad at you, right? Yeah, no shit, and, I, and I'm sorry. You don't think I'm sorry? Guys, not for Helen. Oh, don't mind me. <laughs> I love overhearing stuff. I call it the Erie Canal. <laughs> I'm on the... I don't know what I need to do to prove myself to everyone, but I'm sorry for my part in how things played out. I suffered too. I'm still suffering. Ugh, save the waterworks. Let's just stop the G3, and then we'll never have to see each other again. No holidays, no celebrations, no birthdays, no anniversaries, nothing. That's not what we want. It's what I want. A Bong Lord 69, Otis Club Fan, a Madman, Zek, Panzera, Sindrin, Bamboo, Zan, Budger, Mayo Gooper, Dark AG, CV, Rasipov, and Cap. I think you boys welcome you back. Welcome. Thanks for seven. For seven. Oh, he's. He will see me now. Nice. Well, look who it is. The Big Bad Bounty Hunter. Finally paying me a visit. You're going down! Nipulon. Looks like the bad guy from that ant movie. You don't get it, do you? You still think you're in a few. Wrong! Alright, look, but fuck off. We got enough problems without your monologue. Do you really hate being a truck this much? Maybe you just haven't had a taste of how The fuck? Ooh, looks like it's really kicking in. Have fun. 
Whoa, well, uh, I don't feel so good. Hey, kid, it's me, Normal Gene. Nothing weird or freaky going on. Come over here. Surely. I got to talk. I've been meaning to ask you, why are you doing all this? Don't you get it, kid? There's no hope for you. You're gonna end up just like me. Probably gonna lose your legs, too. I used to be something. Now look at me. Don't fool yourself, kid. This is your future. You're just Gene 2.0, and you're going straight down the drain like I did. Uh, I'd be proud to turn out like you. That ain't true, kid. Look at me. No legs, no home, only two working eyes. I mean, I guess you only got two eyes yourself, but that, that, that's not the point. This is your future. I thought I was invincible. Bounty hunter. Sounds like such a cool job. But really, you're just a glorified garbage man working freelance to take out the trash for anyone willing to pay. Risking your body. For what, kid? So you can lose your legs and find yourself all alone with no one to help you pick up the pieces because you killed everyone you ever met? Does that sound good to you? Uh... Yes. Maybe. Sure. Fine. That's a good point. Okay, you got me there. You conquered this part of your drug trip. Good work. All right. Go make sure you save the world, and then if you suffer, it'll be fine. I guess. Is that the uh, moral here? All right, see you later, sure. kid. Let's dive a little deeper. Oh my god, this is trippy! Actually trippy! So let me get this straight. You're mad humans are just drugs to be shipped around and sold off? Well, that's how things work, moron. It's a circle of life. We're just making the best of it. Be bad at evolution, not us. Okay. Fuck you, David. Yep, it's me again. A whole lot of me. Why are there so many nippy lines? One's gotta be real. Hey there, sleepyhead. <laughs> How's you Don't worry. I'll kill you before it gets too bad. Whoop! <laughs> All right. Let's see how many hours you lost in Fortnite or uh, Minecraft. Do you play those games? I'm trying to do a sort of cycle. <laughs> Just say you played 90 hours of Rocket I haven't played 90 hours of Rocket League. Just pray and pray, motherfucker! Thousands of hours in CS. Hey, can we hurry up and get 
say, we actually have a different color. Alright. Why am I not using... Is he fucking healing or something? Bro. Fucking die! Big deal. Let's say you tackle another round of combat with your inner demons. Oh, oh, since Lizzie's here. Hey, idiot. You need to come talk to me, or mom and dad are gonna be pissed. Tiny human. Do you really think you're doing this to save humanity? You do realize you're just playing the hero, right? Everyone else is dying, but you get to run around space with your little toys, pretending to be the savior of the universe. You're not a hero. You're selfish. This is all about you. It's about saving humanity. Oh, sure, and you think you're the only one who can do that. You think they don't have, like, space institutions in place to deal with villains like the G3 cartel? I'm no. actually asking. I have no idea. I barely know anything about space. It doesn't matter. The point is, this is all about you. You didn't do anything with your life, and now you want to play pretend hero. Well, guess what? It might actually be working. I mean, I don't know anyone else who's doing anything to stop the G3. This might actually be... It might be the right thing for you to do. Oh my god. You! You really are humanity's only hope, aren't you? Fuck. It's true. Another what is this? The, the, the hit indie game Donut County? Which I highly recommend if you're playing this right now. But, you know, pick it up. It's, only, it's sometimes on sale. How you doing? Need some motivation to keep going? How about an award? Here, take this one that says you spent all your in-game playtime at an alien strip club. Oh, that's permanent, by the way. Everyone on your friends list can see that forever now. <laughs> How are you holding up? Facing some dark truths? Oh, Maybe things are a little confusing? <laughs> well, I'll make it clear for you. You're our product! And I'm helping you learn your place. More Nipulons, they're everywhere. <laughs> hey, here's a hat for you. Switch to the other controller cord and you won't be able to hurt me. <laughs> Just kidding. Thank you. <laughs> you let me smoke you now. Uh, oh, you're gonna bring so much pleasure to whoever smokes you. <laughs> <Cool. laughs> hey, sorry, I don't want to do this all day. <laughs> yeah. Was that even the real me? God, you're really having a rough go of it. How much longer can you hold on to your sanity? Looks like I don't know. Just I'm already band insane. Of hero guns together. Oh my god, you found me. I was freaking out. I, I was worried. I was worried I'd lost you. Oh, bounty hunter. I'm literally so happy to see you again. You have no idea. I was for real freaking out. About time? How'd you even manage without me, huh? There's my buddy. There we are. I was on the fence for a minute there, but deep down I knew you wouldn't leave me behind. Is there one more? Kenny, 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 what is it now? I 
I don't know. Oh, Kenny. I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry I let everyone down. I, I was selfish and stupid, and I beat myself up for it every single day, and I'm so glad I found all of you because you've given me reason to live again. Oh, Kenny. Well, don't get all mushy about it. I, I, ju I just, I just want to make things right. You can. We all can. Well, to be honest, I'd given up on everything before you guys came along. 70 show reference. You, but now we're a team, oh, and shit. we're unstoppable. God damn it. He's right. You, you, mean, you mean it? Yeah, dumbass. We've all made mistakes. I mean, not Kenny-level planet-wide genocide mistakes, but we've all made mistakes. And there is no way we're letting your big, big fucking mistake keep us from taking down the G3. So let's kick some fucking ass together. Yeah, that sounds good. Everything they just said sounded really good and smart. I love you all so much. You're the first real family I've ever had. Except for my little kids I spawned to shoot at bad guys. And the family I probably had before the G3 fucked with my brain and ruined all my memories. Let's do this, bounty hunter. As a let's family. fucking do this. Thanks, everyone. No. Let's fucking do this. All right, that's it. I'm gonna Pyro, leave it one year, dude. Game data now. I can batch. do that. It's easy. You'll have to start all over. Here we go. You ready? Okay. Does that work? No. Ah. Uh, I'm still here. Help. I'm stuck. What the fuck? I'm fucking dead, in case you weren't aware, I'm fucking dead. I'm actually fucking dead. Okay, we're fine. Thank you, Call of Duty healing. that what the fuck is is this about the virus that wiped out Gatlas? all right we're in okay the earth coordinate should be logged in here somewhere fuck yeah biatch we got him Let's let's cut a nipple off. Let's do it. Nipple Rick. All right. See you later. What for you? Where the fuck is Helen? Hey, kick you with the six years. I have been sub to you. Care Twice as longer shit. than my dad stuck Barry around, his strong man. Nice. You mess this up too. No, shut up. I guess. Like you'll want to talk after your little Not Winnebago for you. honeymoon. But uh, relatively nice for everyone. Join the badge. Uh, what are you up to? I? I'm more worried about you. Are your guns still all uh, mad at each other? You nah, all gotta get on fine. the same page if you want to be garmantuous. I don't want you to fuck this up right at the finish line. Just keep it together. You've been doing a great job. 
Whoa, be, be, be careful with him. Real smooth, Gene. That's supposed to happen. I know. I meant that sincerely. I just don't know actually how to be nice to what you. What the fuck are you holding? Gene oh. almost killed your super gun all over again. Don't listen to her. I'm about to do some real Frankenstein shit here. Oh, God. I don't know if I'm going to be able to look him in the eye. <sighs> That's fine. I think we accidentally severed his optic nerves earlier. What are you staring at, dork? I really have to fart. Oh, for fuck's sake. You know, I thought you were actually gonna say something nice. Yeah, or maybe thank you for watching all these GooTube tutorials on Gatlian surgery while you were out cutting off a guy's nipples. Fine, hey. thank you. I have to watch right. fucking train Almost videos. Stand Stop back, complaining. everyone. Here we go. Is he? Wait for it. Let's do it. Les, is that... Is that you? Let's do it. Oh. Let's do it. Oh, it's uh, Sylvester Stallone. Let's do it. Let's do it. Talk to me. Let's do it. So what, all he can say is his name? This is sad. Listen, everything else I did was perfect. He can shoot, he can think, he can shit, he just can't talk right. But he's all in there, right? Like, he knows who I am? Let's do it. Les, I, I can't. Let's do it. I'm so sorry. Why am I holding I, the gun let's like this? I, I can't believe I didn't have to tell everybody what I did. What the, Kenny, are you kidding me right now? Fuck off, Kenny. Kenny. Fuck off. What? What? I And I'm happy to see my friend, okay? Fuck. See, I'm not the worst scumbag here. Wow. This is really it, huh? Let's do it. You got the earth coordinates, right? It's time for your final mission. All right. You ready, new gun? Hey, kid. Looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. <laughs> this might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? Uh, I need to spend my money. Hang on. Oh, what? I cannot even go out because they attacked the city. So what the fuck do I do with my credits that I just fucking turned hey, in? I know this has been hard. I'm I'm really glad we have each other. But if you die, I'm gonna have to tell everyone about all that hentai I found on your computer. So don't die. Because I... I don't want to have to tell everyone about all your hentai. Nobody's gonna give a shit. Everyone in space loves hentai. It's great. All right. You have to warp it in. Where do you uh where do you warp it in? Oh wait, here you warp it in actually. I just realized. Uh Hmm. No. Uh, is it gonna be under attack? I just wanna spend my fucking uh, my shit. No, we're we're fine. Uh, I believe. Oh, we have a couple of other crystals as well to spend here. I think it's this guy here, the chef. Yo, bounty hunter, come see what I've got in stock on the food menu. Quote unquote hey, food. Hey, welcome to Blordo's. I'm Blordo. You here for the food? Or the other stuff? The other stuff. <laughs> what, what do you mean other stuff? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Forget I said anything. <laughs> no, come on, we're we're good. T tell us. Oh, fine. I sell secret shit if you know what to ask for, but don't tell the cops. Now order something or leave. I'm gonna have the... Oh, yo, movie theater. Warp disc. Trolley tracks. Oh, shit. This is the, the trolley. Ah, oh, shit. We only have four. We can save for one and buy the trolley tracks. I should have do more now. 
What did I buy this for? I, bought, I spent 10 on this quiet cottage. Sure thing. I don't even know how to use these. Where do you... I mean, you, you download on a disc and then you warp it in, but where? Like, I have to find a specific spot? Ah, okay, I have to find a specific spot for each and every one of those. And yeah. Greetings, valued customer. Oh, you're still here. Uh, do anything cool, new, fresh, for me? What is this? Kinetic tank. Let's say you want to make a jumper go a little higher. Can you do that? Ah, oh. with nine thousand five hundred dollars. Okay, it's really pretty cool. We all agree on that. But what if you could go faster, stronger? Hmm. Remote detonator. Sweezy can eat my balls. Ammo sack. Uh, Did you clean the bathroom? Yeah, I'm going to buy. I'm going to buy this slide unit actually. I regret not buying it because I have to go in melee sometimes. Uh, we're gonna buy the fucking jetpack booster. All right, we're gonna fucking max out on jetpack. Yeah, that's right. Choice. Retard a play. Fit for a little shit. The fuck you say about me, you piece of shit? Uh, buy this. Nice okay. going. You really know how to spot a good deal, partner. Thank you. I'm buying I think you. you'll be happy with that. Uh, anything else? I want no. All right. Congrats on your purchase. What a fucking cookie. I want you to fuck my wife. Would you chill out? They don't need to die. Going back. I don't know where the movie this goes. Doesn't say. What does this blue symbol mean though? What does this mean? Is this it? Because there's a house here? I just wanna see if this is it. I gotta check it. Because there's the mansion that you summon, and you summon the boss guy, whatever, right? Yeah, this thing is what we're looking for here, actually. See what this is. I paid ten for this fucker. Chat you are one big meanie. Chat you're one big meanie, he says. You gonna sit there and take that chat? Like you little bitch you are. Welcome home. Oh company! How wonderful! Oh I'm so sorry. Yeah, that is Just fucking sick. I'm sorry. I was re instinct reactions. Oh my god. Oh my god. I can't bear it. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. All dead. All dead. Oh god. I thought today was going to be one way and it was the other way. It was the way of and now I'm gonna leave you for the ultimate family. pain. Oh god, everyone's dead. Please take me. No. Take me next. Don't take me. 
don't take me. I was joking. Don't do it. But do it if you must. Because I can't live in a world without... Oh, God, just kill me. I can't live in a world without the others' boxes. Oh, fuck you, fuck. Come here, come here. Oh, God. Oh, oh, oh God. Oh, God. Oh, we'll be taking this loot, I guess. Jesus Christ. Fuck. I mean, at least they spent enough time on the script. I can see past this. Hang on, I think that's a crystal for me that we need. I managed to dupe a bunch of these, but now it seems to be hot fixed or something. What? Oh. Alright, let's see what else we have here. Cutie Town Warp Disk. your town? Oh, hello there. <laughs> I'm Cutie Hubie, and it's my great pleasure to introduce you to Little Cutie Town. Oh, fantastic. You've decided to take a look around Little Cutie Town. Oh, oh my god. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, you're destroying everything. Oh, my god, you're so big. I, I, didn't, I didn't realize how big you were compared to our town. Oh my god, it's really obvious now. I just didn't realize how much damage you do. Oh my god, I shouldn't have invited you in. Oh my god, what did I do? That's my childhood home. You just stepped on some puppies. Oh my Oh no, you just crossed our hospital. We have a state-of-the-art healthcare program here. Ah, that was our power plant, our nuclear power plant. Totally safe, by the way, until you came and triggered a new... Oh, you're destroying our historic monuments. Oh my god, that's little cutie town hall. That's where our founding fathers signed the original peace treaty that us little cuties have lived by for centuries. No bloodshed, no violence, just perfect. Okay, that's it. That's my whole, my whole town, my whole little cutie town's ruined. You ruined the whole city. All you ruined? Dead. I'm the only last little cutie alive, and I am going to kill myself. I guarantee it. As soon as you walk away, I'm gonna be so depressed I just pop a gun in my own head and I die. I'm just gonna fucking die. How's that sound? No more living for me. I don't want to be alive. My whole town and home is gone and dead and you did it. It's your fault. I know I invited you in, but you should have realized you're so big. You're going to ruin things. You should have told me. I didn't think about it. I'm kind of dumb sometimes, but you're you're not as dumb as me, I, I assume. So you should have said, hey, I'm not going to go in there. I don't want to stomp on shit like a big Godzilla. Not for me. Not, my, not what I want to do with my life. I don't want to go kill everybody. That's what you should have said. Instead, you just did it. You walked in and you knocked over entire buildings. Everyone's dead now. I am I am so sad. I'm so fucking sad right now. I know that I, I mostly I'm just yelling, but if you if you let me just calm down for a second, which I'm gonna do, okay, I'm gonna calm down right now. I am so fucking sad. I'm so fucking depressed now. Do you have a, can, just shoot me. Shoot me with your gun. Go ahead and shoot me. Well Jesus, I wasn't sure if you were gonna actually kill him. Poor guy. You know, maybe it was the right thing to do. Put him out of his misery. Wait a second. It said that. No, no, man. Never mind. I'll find someone like you. Movie theater. Save the universe. 
Wait, they have... These are new movies. I don't know if they actually... Whoa, what are we watching? Starting. You know, we deserve a break. L let's watch. L let's sit down and watch. It's starting. United Filmmakers presents Paul Hunt, Michael Bennett production. So, guys, what are we watching today? I don't know. It's just a black screen right now. But I'm, I'm very, uh, very anxious. What does it say, Rich? It says Demon. Demon. Wind. wind. Demon wind. Oh, I can hear wind. That's the demon. Are you sure it's not an unrelated wind? <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. Uh, my grandfather went the exact same way. Somebody got burnt on a cross in 1931. It was a lot more common back then, right? Uh, I don't know. We're gonna talk to the entire movie. Oh my god. I thought I told you before. Keep Fluffy in her cage at night. It's the worst family barbecue ever. I, I, I figured out the fa uh, family lineage, by the way, gentlemen. I've seen oh, this, this film movie we haven't watched? I, I've seen the film before. Uh, 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 14 different times. Oh my god, you've seen Demon Win 14 times. Yes, and you guys have. So this not. has to be really good then. Well, I no, can't wait. I, I've watched it 14 times so I can figure out what the fuck's going on. I'm sorry, what was that? I wasn't listening. Having a fireplace made out of cardboard and, and paper doesn't seem like the best idea. Jesus was always my favorite family member. <laughs> so what relation is Jesus? I told you I was allergic to your green bean casserole. <laughs> What did the chip the chapter go to? I don't understand that <laughs> joke at all, but I think I do, and I don't like it. <laughs> don't smash it. Hey, don't smash it! I don't understand your joke. Uh, it was a semen joke? Uh, <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> like that's what was coming out of his mouth. All curdled and disgusted. No. And filled with blood. That's what Hollywood does to you. Are you sure we're not watching David Lynch's Dune? This is the Baron, right? Yeah, drink this snow globe. <laughs> drink the snow it's globe? Got, it's got Benadryl in it. <laughs> both of us. This, now, the snow globe is magic. No, my For no reason at all. So she breaks the snow die. globe. It's a Jesus snow globe. The curse is broken. No. So, no. So no. I really don't know. Although this is only the, their second worst thing. I'm not liking this pretty citizen training. Why though? No comments? Is that the end of the movie? Yeah. No. Ladies and gentlemen, Ireland's most advanced expressway. <laughs> Not bad. Pretty good. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> as soon as we meet our hero, Corey, I'll Talk explain to you the lineage. Or you guys just ask me. I mean, this I is can't the hear the fucking movie. Uh, he's taking his girlfriend. How much farther is it to your grandparents? Diane or something? Know. I don't know. I think not. Lily Ray, but... B. Arthur? No, he's driving her... Oh, here's a flashback. He's driving her to visit to find his grandparents' uh, uh, farm farmhouse. Farmhouse. And now this is Corey's dad. He hasn't seen his dad for his whole life, and he decides to look him up and visit him. Oh, shit. Looks like Johnny Depp, kind of. The, the eyes, right? The eyes, right? 
his dad kills Just himself. So a pretty standard Christmas. I mean, yeah, yeah. Maybe he killed himself because he lived in a, no. a cardboard apartment building. Right. Or Corey told him he was going to pursue acting. I'm in this new film called Demon Wind. Fuck this! I'm sorry I ever laid eyes on him. I can't live with the shame of your career. Uh, but he hasn't told his girlfriend about that his father killed himself. All he told her is, listen, uh, we uh, we got to go find my grandparents' farm. Yeah. And and I'm going to invite 12 of my whitest friends to come along. So they can be killed off one by one by demons. I mean, it sounds like a good, like a fun group activity. How many more of them could have rode with in that car? But yeah, it's saved on gas. Yeah, yeah. No room. The back seat was taken up with all of his emotional baggage. Uh, bu, 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 bu. Parents, it's 10 a.m. Do you know where your neglected redheaded stepchild is? Oh my God. You're not going to touch the car with that stick. <laughs> it's just not going to happen. <laughs> also, they invented soap. That <laughs> little girl <laughs> get in the bathtub. Unless you're a ghost. You think she's a ghost? I don't know. There, there's no indication that she is or isn't. She looks like she could be in breath. <laughs> That's why I thought this was Ireland. Some, some, some scummy, dirty Irish child is just in the shot. Unwashed Irish child is it just in their shot? Do you just assume that they don't take baths in Ireland? I don't know. I don't know much about Ireland. They're fucking aliens. Isn't driving fun. My immersion. So? Don't you love watching people drive? Just that sense. Somewhere rich in a film. Since I saw my old man, there's. Uh, That's. I mean, it's works in Cannibal Run. Would like like you say Demon Wind is the Cannonball Run of horror films? <laughs> I think that's a very accurate statement, yes. <laughs> it sounded like you said cannibal run. I did the first time. Uh, no, Rich. Oh. So we're gonna we're gonna workshop that later. <laughs> okay. Can cannibal run? <laughs> cannibal run's a good name for a horror film. Clint Eastwood. First we gotta talk about this gas station. I've been here before. And what? this very common dream. dream that I've had. I don't know about you guys. It's being naked at a gas station you've never been to before? Right. We're holding a... What is he holding? I think he's there for a loot job. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're naked at a gas station. And the bloody mother comes out and laughs at you. We've had this dream before. Oh, that's not his mother. That's his grandmother. Yes. Would you like me to talk about the lineage yet? <laughs> why, don't you, why don't you please tell me about the lineage? Well, they're about to go inside the gas station, and that's some of the best scenes in the film. So we get to see the paper mache no, no, no. gas station. Sorry. You just have to make a dream. It's pretty insane. I'll wait till the next driver is okay, to talk about the lineage. I still don't understand it. Yes. There's lots of driving and walking and waiting. But why? That was the original title of the film. <laughs> Corey. Corey, are you alright? Yeah. This road is really doing a number on my hemorrhoids. Well, I'm, I'm fine now, really. Oopsie. They spot the gas station from the top of the hill, and then they take the car three miles an hour to the gas station so that we can wait even longer for them to get there. This is where he chose to put his gas station? This does seem like a terrible location. Oh, thank God. I haven't had a customer since 1952. There's not even like a gravel parking lot. It's just in the middle of a field. Because it's fake. It's a <laughs> fake gas station, Jay. Oh. There's literally no infrastructure around to, where they could fill the gas tanks up <laughs> under the ground or anything. But it's it's a spooky supernatural gas station. Oh, like, it shouldn't be there. What can I do you for? Maybe if that if it's a ghost a gas station, here. perhaps. But I think you they can? just didn't want to film at a real place. gas station. This map it, that's it, right near here. Just made one. I, I, I the first time I saw this film, I thought that it was going to blow up. She wants some gas. Know? It's like when they have an old car in the middle of the field. Oh, oh yeah, you know was, what's coming. This film was destined. 
<laughs> no, no, the gas station. I can't <laughs> shoot them. <laughs> There's no such place as a barber shop either, so don't go looking for that. Do you think these gas pumps actually Maybe work? Right. The map could be wrong. Do you think these it's actors cool. actually work? No, not anymore. Not after Demon Wind came out. This is the place in the dream. I mean, if you had a dream where you were naked and your mother was bloody because her throat ripped open, would you stop at this gas station? <laughs> I probably wouldn't. I'd skip it. I mean, they got a window made out of white duct tape. It looks like Pee Wee's Playhouse. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that junky looking. And Rich, this is a gas station, not a high school play set. <laughs> I guess this movie takes place in a world where all the buildings are constructed from paper mache. Hello? Yeah, it's plywood. <laughs> okay. Anybody here? Well, the, the window on that door is definitely made of white duct tape. It's like a pla it's like like Hello? plastic tarp. <laughs> and that's like cardboard. Oh, I picked the wrong boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> that oh, window is right really. Hey lady, the the bad yeah, no, He was the one that was naked in the dream. Hey Harmon. Oh, she's going to release some demon wind. <laughs> oh no. Uh <laughs> This is very common behavior. It's very realistic. A moon for the misbegotten. This is what the humans do? Please. Corey, I just want you to lighten up. Is this movie made by the demon wind? Maybe they're on their honeymoon? Bathroom's out back. <coughs> I'm afraid uh, the character no, made a joke about that. Can we get something to drink? <laughs> he says something about a moon. I think it's a quote from something. We have beer, coke, water, and goat's milk. Ooh, I'll take the goat's milk. Uh, coat, please. Thanks. Thank you. Has anyone else been in here today? Old man Deavers a week ago. And Mrs. Wilson came by with little Linda. It looks like she's from 1940 or 30. Is she a ghost? I think she's a ghost. Did you meet her when she you think? Or a demon? Yeah. A demon disguised as a person? I think she's a demon ghost from the 19th, from Grandma's time. Do you think they're turning a profit with those 50 cent away. fish burgers? <laughs> Did you meet little Linda? Well, I mean, nobody drives by there for gas. No, we so they gotta go supplement anymore. their income somehow. Uh, can you tell us how far the Carter farm is? Do you think gas here? pumps even work? No. They're just there for show. It's like a decoration. <laughs> to entice yeah, so. you to come in and get a sandwich? Right. A fish <laughs> to burger. get a fish burger. <laughs> a barbecue. A barbecued fish burger? Sure, why not? Hey, I need some gas. Oh, our gas pumps don't work. Gotta be come on, have a fish burger <laughs> while you're here. And some goat's milk. I, 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 I still understand why Dell kisses her on the mouth. Like a, they're a very close group of friends. It's a little, it's a little uh, you know, that's like his best buddy's girlfriend, and he just no. kisses her on the fucking mouth. Well, now, don't you look good enough He's to the eat. Asshole. What? This character is the asshole. Corey, my man. Why are the jocks just appearing out of nowhere? Oh. Uh, I tell. How's the drive? Wait, what? He's the asshole. You know Del just are. spreads That's around. Last last Who was the girl that took off her pants? Now, Corey has invited... Uh, I'm so confused. <laughs> friends ...to go with him to his haunted grandparents' cabin for no reason at all. Perhaps for them Bad to get killed. Yeah. Around. Or turned into demons. Uh, they're there for emotional support. He knows what he's going to find at this abandoned cabin that somebody died at 60 years earlier. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You, you need 25 of your your 40-year-old uh, high school friends. Bizarre greeting rituals of the subculture. Thanks for coming with me on this very, very vague Good mission. Good afternoon, Mr. Harmon. Jack, man, am I tell you all about it when we get to the your message demonically very... possessed burnt down cabin. <laughs> Thanks for coming. Then I'll tell you all about why you're here. Yeah, well, if you two homos can keep your hands off each other for a second, let's Sign get something Sign me up, Corey. Maybe Corey can tell us why we're out here in the sticks. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Uh, I mean, the important part is that uh, he, he invited his entire high school class to come hang out at the cabin with him for some reason. Anybody want a beer? His 90s friends. <laughs> no, we're fine. We're fine. What is it? Just say no week? 
I'll tell Not you all me. about my family's depressing history for a couple of fish burgers. Or some Cokes and a Milwaukee's Best. No, we don't drink that filth. Has there ever been a more ironically titled beer? Uh, it's so no. funny. <laughs> I, I suppose not. It? Nothing, Del. No, no, we're just down here talking about your dick. It's a little thing, Del. It's not worth mentioning. So I guess, right. oh, she da she must have dated so, him. Boring, uh, the blonde. Why'd you bring this up? Who's, who's, Cor who's Corey's girlfriend. Is he okay? Because they were talking about no, Del's um, penis size. <laughs> Oh, her he name's Elaine, by the way. The girlfriend? Her, Elaine. Yeah. I know. Uh, I, uh, uh, I'm just gonna uh, accept that these guys are the new subtitles for this four movie. Four days after he was born. Oh, Barbara, or fucking something like that. They'll just explain it for me. Near here. I wrote it down. Dad, that happen? He was in an incubator in a hospital. Give me a minute. If he hadn't been there. <laughs> I gotta go through no. my notes. I'll give you several Anyone minutes. Anyone ever find his family? No, uh, but yeah. right after I was born, he came up here to find out what happened. She's the only one who showed up for the. He never came home. I think something bizarre has been going on at that farm for a long right. time. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna find out what. They killed themselves. <laughs> oh, geez. So the sequel to this movie is gonna be meta, and it's gonna be the filmmakers traveling to this cabin to find out why the actors killed themselves. If the subtitles weren't so fucking mistimed. <laughs> Years ago. <laughs> <laughs> that would be the a next great day he killed himself. <laughs> <The> next day. <laughs> All the demons on the young dead you demons are the people that attended the premiere. <laughs> there was a fire <laughs> at the premiere. We've got business at that farm. Demon Belongs to me now. I keep hoping you something different. You do not own happens. that property. Oh yeah. Like it'll change. They just who owns the land, old man? Like Clue. When I was released in theaters yeah. and had different endings? Right. One of these days, you'll walk into the theater to see Demon Win, and it'll be the ending that makes sense? Uh, yeah. I keep buying Blu-rays, hoping the dead. that Blu-ray will be different. You know, you not only got an attitude problem, always hoping that you're also in your fucking mind. You gotta learn to respect the elders, boy. Before I hurt you. Just hold on a minute Is that on the menu? That's on the menu. We don't want any trouble. It's all... There's no, there's no, uh, no, 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 there's no vegetarian options. <laughs> all it's it's all like cars. weird, disgusting Go back food where you that came cost from. 50 cents. Oh. See, oh, oh yeah, pastrami, ham sandwich, the, fish yeah. burger. Fish burger, a hot link sandwich. Uh oh, can we get back to the menu? Okay, fried chicken, barbecue beef sandwich. Uh, uh, so they have a lot of meat, meat options. What are you trying to hide? And that's it. Saw what Nobody paid for the their family. cokes or, or their beer. Originally, I thought it was Ireland, but it's shot in Thousand Oaks, California. Summer. The cattle and outside the of Los Angeles, Chris. by the ro rolling the hills of Thousand Oaks, California, the which is doubling for some kind of country in the area. You cannot mute them. They're not enemies, they're not guns. Boys. All the families were in rather church. vague. They're unmutable. I just wish they would have a louder audio on the fucking movie. Uh, yeah, you know what? That's, that's, that's enough of that. Uh, Shh. A thousand jokes. I saw them. What did you see? Commentary track. We're in a movie theater. All right. Sorry. That's what you should say while we're in this movie theater. As aliens. It's a good thing that there's no other people watching this movie. They'd be very upset that we keep talking about it. Right. They would miss the plot. Anyways, God damn it. you guys are ready, I can tell you the lineage. Yes, I'm ready oh, right okay, now yeah, let's let's watch a little more. Characters I don't care about. <laughs> What's well, that? It's not so much about these characters. It's more the backstory. Okay. Of the entire premise of the film. But here, our harbinger of doom is warning them to n go, not go to the cabin. Are those guys you know, really gonna just the talk the, the whole time? No, it ain't even. He look. is an insane priest. Please, boy. Uh, don't go up there. Turns into the, sun the fuck? Sand, the gun disappeared. And his legion of demons. I know. Are there? I'm so afraid to move my mouse. Oh, that road too. 
child. Luring these unsuspected, uh, unsuspecting kids to their the grandparents' farm to be turned into demons, <laughs> it's right? right? Instead right. of warning them away, right, Rich? It's a reverse psychology. It was very effective. Okay, you, you think <laughs> you think he was going for a reverse psychology? Pleasant good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Oh no, who invited Dracula? Rich, more friends are showing up. These are the magician the friends. Illusion and fantasy, where the kind of place more friends? No. Oh, it's or, or Cucumber Benedict. This is, a, this is the early roles for Sean Penn we'll and Ken Bacon. As man in a Dracula costume. <laughs> <laughs> He's a magician. That's a magician's cape. It's a, okay, sure. Hardcore is not impressed. Now, Mike, you've seen this before, right? Yes, I, I keep have. hearing Harry Sports Potter music. Yes, I have. Uh, I'm assuming. You see, it's him. Really I told you. Hammering it in that this guy's a magician. I'm assuming that's going to pay off later, right? It's uh, the, cucumber. You know, watch. He's a, he's a kung fu magician. <laughs> watch, look. Oh my God! I saw you. I saw you do that. Yeah, you did that thing earlier today. Yeah. Were you trying to reenact this movie? I was. The famous can kicking scene. It's a staple of most magic acts. And I don't know why anyone would show up in a tuxedo <laughs> doing magic tricks when you're going chicken shit. I'll shove that karate crap up your ass. Quest to you find your guess? friends to have grandparents go down the cabin. Easy now. Apparently he brought a rabbit with him too, just to do this now, one trick. Actually, he just did the smoke bomb thing, and then the rabbit happened to be there. Oh! So it's like fortuitous. Yeah. Wow, that's great. Cool out. He has dozens of rabbits on his person at all times. Okay, just in case something comes up. You never we know. We don't need Richard this. Sean Penn, not Richard you know Gere. I are they both magicians? Or is this the magician's assistant, it. and they couldn't get oh, an actress? In this a there could be two magicians. Like this, I disagree. I wonder to the hinterlands. I honestly beautiful people. I was surprised oh, man, to find out this was a uh, um, film made in the U.S. <laughs> I mean, it, it has all the markings of like a weird so Italian movie. You tried to make something American. Yeah, magic. But so, it uh, was shot in Los Angeles. What exactly by is the nature that's People in the Hollywood man. system. No, by low budget. Of course, I'll show you. Dale, you still coming? They didn't even know. Yeah, yeah, we're in. No, they've all been driving for hours to go to right, an yeah. undisclosed location I don't know for why unknown I'm reasons. For These are some good fucking friends. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's not much to do in this. Uh, uh, I guess they're. I don't know where they're all from. I don't think the movie ever tells us. I right, drove four hours to be here. What's going on? Yeah, I wore my best tuxedo and Dracula cape. Well, I recognize the magician. He's the only actor in the film I recognize. And it's not because he looks like Kevin Bacon. He's in the film Shock Him Dead. Where he played a nerd turned rock and roller. Oh, yeah. That, that has to eat souls. So, we bitch watch that? idiots. We've seen that. Film, this is yeah. better. Tracy Lords. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's funny because. Son of a bitch and idiots. That sounds like an Italian. Uh, All the son way, of a bitch and idiots. But now the gun is here. I was gonna say it's funny because there's also a bad porno think, boy. In this too. There is? Maybe yeah. so, but it's mine. Is it the old man? No, the nudity lady who comes out of the woods and, and kind of lures them out of the house, remember? Oh. No, I don't remember because this is the first time I've seen this. And I think You're the only one who's seen it multiple times now. I think I looked up all these actors on like IMDb and almost every one of them ended up in the porn <laughs> after this. Well, you know. Whether it's softcore. Remember all those softcore programs, the Red Shoe Diaries, Oh, sure. Passion something, all those na all those titles were coming up. All those Skinamax late night him too. Flicks that Rich would tape on the VCR and label as football game. <laughs> I knew what you were up to back in the day. Why do you have so many VHS tapes labeled football game? Football game one, football game two. Uh, that was the sticky one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone, we're back on the road. If anyone spots the plot, let me know. What, they just throw garbage out they of their just, car. No, they just throw out their magician uniforms. <laughs> oh, because they realized they weren't going to, like, a resort with people. Yeah, but this probably were expensive. <laughs> I, I mean, that Dracula suit. 
Looked like a fairly nice Dracula suit. You would think if he wants to be a professional magician, he would want to hold on to that, even if he's not going to use it this weekend. This, this magician code jump. You're only allowed to use your outfit once. Then it must be destroyed. Yes. Do you think, like, some horror movies are made as just an excuse to, you know, fill a movie with, like, gore, or maybe some nudity? Is this movie just an excuse to film people driving? <laughs> <laughs> they found a, a knife with a bunch of maggots in it. accidentally got in the shot? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway, oh, should I tell you all about the history? <laughs> yes, Mike. Please tell me all about the history. No. I'm we waiting. got time. We need context. Okay. So June eighth, nineteen twenty nine. Corey's I need to have father was born. Should I go? Should I go chronologically here? Yes, you probably should. The 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 farm. Oh oh, I think I'm gonna have to wait. Oh look, the grade school kids were doing Shakespeare in the park. <laughs> Is the skeleton a part of the family lineage? Uh, I don't know who the skeleton is. That's, is that Uncle Remus? I can't believe they left that up there for 30 years. More than 30. More than 30, yes. 30 years 60. ago is when the gram... Or no. Who died 30 years ago, Mike? I, I have it all. I have it all written out. I, I, I You know, you keep saying that. I don't believe it. <laughs> So the, I think the skeleton was burnt in 1931. That's what we saw in the, the opening, yeah. yeah. And so this is, the movie came out in 1990, so oh, we're going to assume it's 1990. Okay. 1990? 60 years. 60, yeah. The skeleton's been up there for Don't 60 years. Please. And as Rich, you noted before, the ligaments that hold the bones together have not been burnt or rotted away. <laughs> yes. The skeleton remains intact kind of amazing. Yeah, it, does, it just doesn't fall into pieces. I guess there's no police in Ireland. Or no one drives down this road ever? I don't know. Like, literally ever. Does ever? this take place in Ireland? I know you said it's no, shot in California. No, I'm just joking around because it looks like Ireland. <laughs> <laughs> Do they say where it's supposed to take place? They don't. I think, uh, I, I think we'd like to talk now about the set and, um, what, what what all this is before I get into the lineage. Okay. I may not have time to squeeze it in. Oh my god. <gasps> What's the fucking problem, Bonnie? You're studying to be an anthropologist. Oh no! Oh my god, that's... That was Skeletor's brother. It's all completely irrelevant. Is that the... Uh, okay, so never go full retard? Corey's dad's brother. Now let me, let me, let me get into it. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm waiting. Okay. I'm very excited. So the film opens in 1931. Simple <laughs> Jack, that's it. Across, I don't know why. The, the yeah, two people we see in the opening of the film are Regina and How'd George, you know which are just the know. grandparents of Corey. Yes. But the that's not where the story right starts. Here. Oh my god. The Somebody story really the starts through here, in the 1800s. And set fire to the the house. farm was built by Corey's great-grandparents, uh, and they followed a guy named Anders, who decided to start a satanic cult. Uh, and the satanic cult killed three little girls, and then the townsfolk gathered up all the satanic cult members and here. burned them all to death, death potentially this on this land. Ah. Um, sort of like a, a Freddy Krueger-ish kind of backstory, yeah. right? And they said, we don't want your satanic cult here. Uh, and then flash forward to 1931, Cor the, uh, Cor Corey's uh, uh, grandpa uh, grandparents live on the farm. Um, I, I have to stop because we have to talk about this. Watch this magic bridge. What? <laughs> Why do you think they did that? I'm gonna give you 14 guesses. Okay. Watch this, though. Watch this. Ready? <laughs> Ready? Watch this. <laughs> now. Corey. 
They did it because it's magical and weird and creepy. Corey. Now let's see. Watch, Rich. Watch. Are you watching? I'm watching. <laughs> I actually find this this is interesting right now because she doesn't see him. That's great. I'm going inside. It, Corey, wait. What's it? Why is it happening? So they could film on a sound stage. Oh. That's why. You know why, Jay. <laughs> <laughs> what? I have to see what's through that door. You guys can wait out here. Is it hey, like, oh, we you. already wrote our opening scene where the cabin blows up, but we have to have somewhere for our characters to go? So they'll just go to the remnants of the cabin? I think the idea was and that... magic the, happens? Just, just change the opening scene. I'm assuming they didn't have a good exterior where they could film at. They didn't know where to find yeah. a I mean, they're time course. traveling back, yeah, that's, obviously. Yes, exactly. they, they wanted to make Evil Dead, and they, they wanted a cabin in the woods in, in deep forest at night, dark, spooky forest with, with smoke and And it's that they don't have a cabin or woods. Right. So they had Thousand Oaks, California, <laughs> the rolling hills in 70 degree temperatures and no woods around. They'd have to drive pretty far out of the Los Angeles area to go find, like, spooky woods. Yeah. So they just set up a, like, junk in the middle of nowhere, and then they go inside a magical cabin. And they, they used an existing set built for some high school production to for Regina. their main location. Right. With all my love. Oh, look, Rich. <laughs> Magic. <laughs> Seamless. She looks just how I remember her. Her head fell off and she started on fire when the house blew up. <laughs> but the house is still there, but Grandma's burnt up bones. No one ever cleared it out, I guess. And nobody ever w poked around here. The cops never showed up. Then again, we are in a magical interior that doesn't really exist. Would, would like a police officer that drove up to investigate the skeleton on a cross? Like, <laughs> why, why does this look so bad? Because it's an optical effect. But that should be the easiest effect to do and have it be pretty seamless, right? Just put the camera on a fucking tripod. Well, they, well, they did. did that, but when back in the, the days of film, you would have a little bit of fluttering the, the, the of film, the film. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. okay. No, no. Don't do that. New protesta Santana Vivet. Paper mache fireplace. Up the demon. Firecrackers. Get out of here! Some shots are crappy. <laughs> what the hell's going on here? I don't, I don't know. I don't know. What was the bunny red? What did it say? It's it was Latin. It said Dal Satan shall walk. Yes. Yeah. It's not from a real production. Yeah. When they're, 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 yeah. they're almost. Hey now, are you saying even when it's not a real you production? I am. Yes. Oh, okay. I'm going to find uh, out yeah, why. Just making sure. Yeah, we got uh, 50 feet left on this, this roll. Just change it out. We didn't use it on Back to the Future. Yes. Yeah, we're going to give it the demon Yes. Let's get the hell out of here. Film people and go, Do you have any short ends? Sure, here's a whole ton of them. Okay, no way. I think for three years, the Bluetooth, welcome back, and the badge. Cryptix Ninja Iron Pack, whoop, welcome back. This dice comments are funny sometimes, but not always. I tell you what, how are you guys, Jack? What Are you house? enjoying the movie? Still better uh, than the gameplay, right? Oh! 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 You don't hear yeah. any. For us, bye bye. Come here. Promise me something. Anything. True. If we die, don't bury me here. You're not going to die. It's a weird thing to say, but 
promise. Not gonna die. Okay, I promise, but nothing's going to happen. I'm actually not going to turn it. into a plastic doll and start. Let's get her out of here. Okay, let's <laughs> I'm almost certain that's not going to happen to you, Bonnie. Bonnie's 100% that dead. Be very strange. I w then I wouldn't have to bury you, right? So I promise that I won't bury you, Bonnie. And uh, what's wrong with their cars? They won't start up or. Doll and then start on fire. Oh, back to the lineage. Oh, EMP. So, 1890s, satanic cult, farm, doll burnt up. Flash forward to 1931, Corey's grandparents are there. It says Mrs. James, which I think is Corey's grandma, had triplets. They were killed right after birth, they weren't even human. All the children were the same except for Look Corey's dad. Why was he different? I don't know. <laughs> and then Corey's dad also had an older brother, which is the kid they show running up and spitting Spit blood. Spitting blood, yeah. So I guess she had five yes. kids? And the triplets? I don't understand it. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're in trouble. Two normal kids and three demon babies. I You're get right. it, I get it. But the dialogue says she had four like kids, this. and one of them was it's not the same forest. forest. Right? Miss forest. James had triplets. Yeah, and on the triplets. Floor. They okay. were killed right after birth. The same power they that was wasn't that even house. human. Look, it's coming back! Uh, and that's it. So his dad survived out of all the kids, I guess. Oh, the dad was in um, an incubator during the events of the Oh! Uh, Turn the fucking evidence off! Turn the fucking evidence off. 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 I've never seen this. I don't know what's oh, going to happen. No. Does he also Son have alienation bitch. DNA in his bloodline? Thermine. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. What? Raiden. So these are the three girls from the 1800s that were sacrificed to Satan oh. by Anders demonic cult. What? These are not the three kids you of from Corey's girl? grandma. That's who I would assume they are. No, look at their attire. They're sure. clearly what? pre 19 why, why do we have so many lineages and, and you three children? I don't know. No! Are they related to the stick girl from no! earlier in no. the film? The stick girl is on the no! What? Oh my god. Oh, you weren't kidding. <laughs> <laughs> hey, is this one of those cabbage patch kids? These are worth a lot of money. Lied. What? Oh no. This seems really sad Did about it. For the worst? I bet none of them could have expected Whatever that Whatever isn't going to let us no. go. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. You got any other hot news for us? Yeah, the sun's going to be down in a few minutes. We got two choices. You know, the that man sounds just like one of house. his friends. But something in there just tried to kill us. <laughs> I don't think <laughs> so. That's an amazing I think whatever it is, we're <laughs> trying to warn us away. It's a traumatic experience. He sold me on the emotion of the moment. Just a feeling I have. Yeah, well, that's just great, pals, because your How feelings would you got into the shithole in the first place. <laughs> I don't know if I could. Oh, my God. What the fuck? What the motherfuck just happened? Holy shit, did you see that? Then you'd start running with like a like a load in your pants. <laughs> what? <laughs> and you'd fall down one of the. What the fuck was that? Roll down in your own filth. You no That'd be really embarrassing if that happened to the blonde guy in this, because he's wearing white sweatpants. That wasn't them. <laughs> it was a poor choice. With all that was not TTS. Yeah, I mean sweatpants are always a bad choice. Dell is just secretly super worried about getting grass stains in his favorite white sweatpants. Come on, Terry, I can see it in your so eyes. Are these two characters together? They were. But now she's with, with, uh... I love you. Uh, what's his face back there? Flash yes. Thompson. Yes. Flash Thompson. <laughs> and, and he's with Sean Penn now. Don't need okay. me. Okay. You don't. They're game magicians. You switch teams. To you. Okay. It's not to me. I need somebody who's serious about me. Dell is. Is <laughs> the time <laughs> for that conversation? No. Yeah, the friend just turned into a plastic doll and started on fire. What the fuck? I, I, it's not really the time. We could fight if you want to. 
Maybe they weren't that close to her. Right. But we don't have anything to fight about. They should have blamed uh, Kevin Bacon and Sean Penn and said that. Well, let's go inside then. Tricks, right? Good idea. That's what they call self and pay off. <laughs> yeah, that was one of your fucking magic tricks, Kevin Bacon, and he starts punching him. Bring her back. Bring her back, bro. Hey, that's good. Yeah. But, like, one of them just doesn't believe anything that ever happens in the film. The we entire film. Yeah, we've established these two guys show up as magicians, and then they think they're playing. Hello, Mr. Force. I noticed your title Other says Pickle just, Rick. Just Is this the movie you are watching? I yes. could not find Magic it on DuckDuckGo. Exactly. Please clarify. It's only available Hello, in Mr. Games. Force. This is your president of the United States here. I passed my job interview. Okay, you cleaned up for the film crew? Barely. Do you have a fireplace made of construction paper and tinfoil? <laughs> now, why are they cleaning up? I don't know. Because they got to spend the night there. I think it's going to be spend okay. the night where a bunch of firecrackers blow up a turkey <laughs> and glass, right? Not me. That's that's a good point. Yeah. To be fair, they can't leave. Yeah. And they they, they, they ruled out sleeping in their cars because one character said, I don't want to sleep in a Cadillac with you, bro. Look, he's got the, like, the, the, the little things. That oh, hey, he's doing a magician thing. Yeah. Just in the very edge of the frame for no reason. I'm sure we're going to have a big payoff to his magic skills. Yeah. You bet Can't we wait. Are. You bet we are, everybody. What else Holy. is on the sound stage? Grandma's right next to this. <laughs> 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 Just a ghost. Was that, was that his? That wasn't his mom. That would be his grandma. His grandma. Okay. God damn it! I just explained the. Aren't you following it, dude? His mother and his his mother is not in the film at all. His father is. We don't know what happened to his mother. I was, I was about to ask. Did I miss something with the mother? No, it's just not important. I don't know. Maybe she died at some point. I don't know. It's the, really of the grandparents and the great grandparents. Okay, Jay. Okay. I'll take your word for it. Maybe his mother was an alien nation. His there mother. His mother was a third. Mother. There you go. Oh. Good reflexes. Doctor Egon Spangler, his ghost is here. This is proton pack. <laughs> So this is Grandma's uh, diary, right? It's the Necronoticon. Necronoticon? <laughs> How, did you just slip that in there, like, all casually, like? Yeah. Or was that just, did you just mispronounce it and it happened no. to work? No. That's a quality joke that you should it have is. given more prominence. Yeah, you just said it, it so offhand. You did, yeah. I mean, uh, it was really spot on. In the diary of Virginia Carter, <laughs> born June I think 8, that was 1889. an accident. <laughs> No, but, I, I thought of that before we filmed. Okay. So we'll call it the Necronoticon. Uh, Grandma's diary, and she writes in, I don't know, some kind of ancient language. Well, this part's not her diary. This is a book she just found, and then she took over. So this page here, the she alignment. started writing in Sharpie. Protect this is what Grandma this, took over. child from the evil touch. How did the edges get so perfectly Rise burnt? Now and well, she bought it at the Michaels like around someone's... Halloween time. Someone took a lighter to the edges to try to age them. I'm sorry, what was that? I wasn't listening. Christ, you trying to give me a heart attack? I could ask you the same thing. The person who follows ghosts. God. I made you some food. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she made him a bologna sandwich. I'm sure the bologna from some 1931 weekend. is still good. Yeah. They had a cooler. You really know how to show Oh, they did? Food. Yeah. They brought, one of them was holding a cooler. They brought sandwiches? Yeah. I'm glad you're here. I guess no one knew where they were going. Like you had to plan ahead. Someone brought their swimsuit. They brought a cooler full of beer and sandwiches. <laughs> we thought the magician were brought a bunch of rabbits and yeah. uh, doves. We thought he was going to be playing a show, like doing a magic act. <laughs> we thought they were driving down to Cancun. Depending on how the rest of the weekend goes, they're going to be eating it those is rabbits. Dusk. I know tonight I will die. You know, you tell your friends, hey, Even I got an idea. Grandmother we're going to have a mystery vacation. Now. Prepare for anything. Yeah. You never know what we're gonna do. 
And then they show up and someday you're just you like, might oh, get yeah, more face you're gonna evil that comes from me. <laughs> In the you're gonna help me clean out this demonic <laughs> cabin. You're gonna, you're gonna, you're gonna help me clean out my, my dead grandmother's. Demonic the other five cabin. have been lost. His, his plan worked real well because you can kill everyone got whittled down except for him and his girlfriend. I pray these two men invited the proper amount of people. <laughs> to solve the mystery, figure out what was going on at his grandparents' cabin, and he eliminated 11 of his friends. Maybe he doesn't like any of those people. That was his goal exactly. all along. He was tired of getting invited to their, like, parties and uh, events and stuff. He successfully killed off all of his girlfriend's exes. There you go. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> has a dagger. What if we have two daggers? That'll mean our movie's twice as good, right? Yeah. Dual wheel. Oh my god, not issue number one of Good Housekeeping. That's worth a fortune. I saw it on Antiques Roadshow once. Yeah, so the dagger is the, the I think the grandma's journal said. Seven daggers will kill the son of Satan. Found something. I don't this know farm how she was knew built that. by my great grandfather. Uh, but, uh, they he and a they group of settlers two, five followed a creature five named the Enders to this valley. But when they arrived, why, Enders why, began to do what you will with that information, Corey. <laughs> and the true God like he found They never here. find the daggers, right? No. The other daggers? No. Why even bring that up? Yeah. Uh, well, because they used the daggers to, to stab the devil. demons. I know that, but why bring up that there are five the girls disappeared? I don't know. You think the at the end they'd find them? We need all seven. Was yeah. Left yeah. yeah. And then they're buried somewhere place. out, and they have to run and get them, and the son of Satan is running up. after them. And then they have to get to the special spot where the and there's not five all followers are buried. Burned to death in his house. Rises or something. We have to solve the cryptic clues to figure out where they are. You get you get some things happening. Rich. After that, everything was okay you until the summer of 1929. <laughs> your, your knowledge of how a movie your my father Get some popcorn. Far, far I have cashew oh, nuts, I but I want to eat more because I'm going to eat proper James food when I'm done. They were killed but I do need some fucking attention. water because I ate too many <laughs> cashews already. All the fucking <laughs> Sahara Desert. <laughs> enjoying films like Demon. What was so special about him? <laughs> like, why, does it, why don't they do the most, uh, no most logical thing? But the last entry reads. Why doesn't this make any Everyone sense? Maybe yeah, streamline all the uh, the family stuff. It's all sure. hopeless. I can hear them rising out in the barn. Well, we can bring the other daggers uh, back. And oh, too. there you go. Mm, yeah. And that's what it's happened like to my family. Sir, to the MCU. Now we're yeah. planting the seeds for future Demon Wind Universe films. sequel that was going to happen. Then they thought, better not. <laughs> that's, <laughs> true. That's, that's true. That's true. <laughs> that's not even a joke. Don't <laughs> smash it. Don't smash it. Kick some supernatural ass. The straightforwardness, oh, straightforwardness of that is what made it funny. Too. Just, they were Very in the theater, man. they were watching Very the dailies, and they said, Young Wayne, better not. Jury, what choice do we have? Hello, Mr. Force. I realized something. Dev filled at least half the size of this game with shitty atheist movies so you and us can have our movie night on your birthday. Actually, Dev Bay. Feel strong man claps 10 out of 10. Dirty. Happy birthday, Forson. I think there are only four movies in this, and uh, we have watched now this one and. Here we have our two magicians. Our. Oh my fucking asshole. Uh, it's trying to drag me back in. Yeah, they, they just acknowledge that they understand that 
topless lady is actually a demon. Yeah. So you think if they understand that, they would just stay inside. Yeah. Shoot at her from the window. Should they have a shotgun, bro. Weapons. Yeah, yeah. You think that guy is McCree? Outside? Oh, so they can die. Oh. And the and the 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 demon, the lady, or just whatever force is at work here puts everybody else to sleep. Or just wake your friends up and tell them what you plan to do. <laughs> well, they were they were put to sleep. I don't think they were sleeping naturally. I think the demon would put them to sleep. Mm -hmm. Or whatever evil force is at work lured them out for All no right. reason. I was going to say, what is the demon's plan? What does the demon want? Why can the demon not go in the cabin? Why do you... Why They're like vampires. They have well, to demons, be invited. I don't understand. It's a demon win. Jay, so. they saw Evil Dead. <laughs> and they know how it works. Well, you can't go in the cabin. Okay. Flimsy cabin. <laughs> be easily be able to get in. They can't do it. <laughs> oh, Jay, this, is, this was made in 1990, right? You know, I can so crawl without talking, your help, by the way. You know, just like, in case you were wondering. You know, it's obviously a lot easier if somebody's going to carry me around. But I could crawl, and I'd be just fine with that. You know? Back on Gatlas, we used to have Gatlian hand horses carry us around everywhere. And yeah, it was fine. And then we made robot Why the fuck are you talking? But guess what? We didn't need it. We could cr crawl anywhere we wanted. So, but it is nice that you're carrying me around. And it's much more convenient. Thank you very much. Trouble. I think right. you're right. It looks sort of like a movie. It looks sort of like a movie. Okay. Hey, Quantathon with the 10 gifted, another one. Boom, thank you very much. Congratulations to all the lucky winners. Muchas gracias. How many bullets does he have in his fucking revolver? He's not gonna make it. There's Grandma. What's happening? See, all those demons and all the old period clothing were the, de the, the townsfolk from the 1800s that followed Anders' satanic cult and all got burnt up by the villagers. Okay. Oh, maybe he's running from like a demon? Yeah, uh huh. In the house? And so then, oh, like, no. he can oh, have to have it? The oh, demon no. opens the cabin? And it's empty! Oh! Which, yeah. That is just so simple. Oh. Now we cut, we see him running outside the house. <laughs> so like where the car is to get the dagger. How about he, he leaves his magic hat? Here we look. Uh, we gotta keep our act together. Get out of Hello, Mr. Force. <laughs> Hello, chat. I sure am oh, annoying yeah. this movie. What about you? What if he saws a demon in half? Pass the coat, please. <laughs> oh, oh, the two here comes the best part. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Those are clever things you can do if you have half a brain. <laughs> oh, why didn't you tell oh, me about the dad? Oh, oh, oh. Anyway, 
that my grandmother Here's was ten dollars. Thanks, spell to protect her son in this house. Yes, you tell them that. You're welcome you're for the magical, Jackson's awful situation. Asking. One more thing, and either of them could probably lose. believe you. Because at this point, yeah. They didn't help her much. Oh, oh, is this when he decided to to not tell his friends about his grandma's spell book? Yes. Yeah. After the first girl turned into a doll and started on fire. The that's, whole bets are off, then. That's when you tell them everything. Just open up. My grandparents uh, had some. a demon house, and you're all in it. Whoops. So, in it. addition to the satanic cult, oh, okay. his grandma was a witch. Don't even think that, And that's Corey, I got not related to the demon magic. Uh, that's her own magic. Me. I don't know. And she uses spells to keep the and demons away so from her family. Magic. Right? Yes and no. Oh. That, well, see, there's religious uh, uh, symbolism around, right? There's pictures of Jesus and all that. And yeah. then uh, there's a pentagram on the floor, and then there's, like, Wiccan symbols, and then there's also a crucifix. Why are they always door, sleeping? It's yeah. a little they just, like, wake up, oh, everything. two of us are dead. They, they uh, let's go back to sleep. Know. Yeah, I, I, I think they just said whatever. <laughs> Um, a crucifix on the door, but also some kind of mystical. But also, Wiccan, she's a witch. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And she, and she casts spells, right? <laughs> uh, uh, spells and magic and, and, and witch stuff isn't in line with Christianity. Yeah. Uh, she's a, maybe, maybe, you well, know. That's what voodoo is. Honey, you're all right. It was only But not a dream. Christianity. You're all right I think now. there's some weird mishmash there. Okay. Well, maybe she was a voodoo priest, the lady. I don't know. God, I wish she's, I was I think she just, right maybe she just what? went with whatever could possibly work to keep That's the a car. Going, right? A Professor of Carr? Things, why not? And then some spells. I'll do that too. They should have just moved. It's Willie and Rita. Guns? Sure. Oh, good. More characters. Don't shut it off. She just shut moved. Off. The whole point Don't in introducing your group of characters is to have them get killed off. Don't shut it off. Now we've killed off two Don't characters off. and introduced two more to take their place. How many people did you invite on this trip? <laughs> what did Don't you shut say? it off. It's a Suzuki. It might not oh, be yo. <laughs> Don't shut it off. Also, there's Order. demons. He looks like uh, the actor. What's his name? Um... Uh, you know it. You know what I'm talking about. We just got here. But apparently, they can only do that after the car has already stopped. Right. <laughs> Demons that. can only prevent things from stopping. Not Paul Walker the missile. Get back inside. Full detective. Two have arrived. But, but why? Also, no, I'm serious. Why are there full two detective? Why did the movie need two new friends to show? I honestly, I don't know other than uh, 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 more bodies, but... Can't they just show up with everyone else in the beginning? Yes, the true detective guy. Woody, uh, Woody yeah. guy, yeah, Woody. Hey, well, everybody... It seems like an odd choice to have just two more people just show up. Woody Harrelson. Uh, yeah, well, they have enough people to kill at this point. I mean, there's still Harrelson? four more characters floating around. Del, are you sure you want to do that? Two of the actors quit? Yeah, I'm sure. Sure as anybody anything. Replace them with two new characters? I would normally think that, hey. but I, I didn't hear any signs of that on no, any of the really interviews really. that I was. Like I told you before, honey, where Also, you go, they like? all met up at the gas station, right? Yeah. But then these two new That's characters somehow knew where his grandparents' farm was. I, I don't know. Well, they, they read the script. Oh. You may need this. Thanks, Corey. Okay, so Del... Let's and, get out of here. And his girlfriend are Where? To just leave. They said we're not gonna. Ghost Mist is gonna here. fuck you right back. Hope that the same thing that happened before doesn't happen again. Right? I mean, I guess what other choice do you have? But they just nailed those, those quarter-inch pieces. Of I don't think they're gonna the make door, it. Jay. I don't think so either. The door that is also made of quarter-inch plywood. Better get back to work. Now. Then why you give them the fucking gun? To use that. Going on. <laughs> Very I don't know if these new characters have another line of dialogue. Film. They're just like, uh, start nailing boards yeah. to the window. Yeah, We're in exactly. a situation here. But what's happening? What happened to our magician friends? <laughs> Presto, they disappeared. And why is there a burnt up doll on the front lawn? <laughs> we don't talk about the doll. <laughs> We're all kind of traumatized by that. <laughs> 
Isaac Cory told us about his grandma's spells and the demons. Why is the fireplace made of construction paper? Grandmother? Why is the fireplace made of construction paper? Because it's a cheap set. <laughs> That's why. It is you in the house, isn't it? Did that. Grandmother? What are the demons afraid of? Grandmother? Yeah, I guess that's another thing. We have a satanic grandmother? cult, we have Grandma was a Corey? witch, and now we also have Ghost Grandma. So we have demons, Thousands witches, and ghosts. So ghost Grandma just showed up to tell them where her uh, diary is. No, was. sure. And she never what do you shows mean? up again. Well, I say we attack it. And also, no. he has some kind of psychic connection. Remember, he touched the, the skull. Jack's right. Of his My grandmother dad's the barn. brother. Maybe there's a doorway that, that leads in the into dirt. the barn. Oh the yeah. And the electricity house. came out, and, and then he knew he had a flashback course, where the dad's brother spit up blood. Does the dad's brother tie in with anything? What was the point of that scene? No, the dad, the dad's older brother, he's the kid with the overalls. He's running up and he spits blood out. I remember the scene, but why was that there? Look at the shot. These people show up. Why are there five missing daggers? Because his grandma had three kids. They were triplets. But the dad has an older brother. Oh. Triplets oh, no. usually don't raise in age, ages, right? That's true. They're born at the same time. That's so why they're triplets. triplets. Yeah. Yeah. That'd be a fucked up pregnancy. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it would be a really weird pregnancy. If they're born at different times, then they're just siblings. Right, yes. <laughs> Hello, yeah, Force. Right this is your president of the United States of America here again. No, no. I am still the president. The old man has gone see now at this point. I love kids. Anyway, Chad, you must now all pay $10 for your movie ticket. I want to read for. Same one EU teeth. Well, they're dead now, I guess. No, they're they're now demons. Okay, so here's their only plan, which is <laughs> to walk to the barn. The the the, the rich what you described as the, the yuppie Harry it was Potter. A human, that's what <laughs> says, I saw remnants of an old barn over there. Maybe, just maybe, that's the source of all the demons' powers. Look, considering Cory won't tell them Come about on. the fucking spell book, which is their best chance, they're working with what they have. So I haven't felt something with the barn. Maybe we can do something there. This house isn't working for us. Let's go check out the barn. Uh, it could be the source of the demon. Maybe powers. we'll find an anti-demon device in the barn, or we maybe there's a portal of hell there. And we can close it. Sure. I don't know. I, maybe how, there's nothing there. How to do that? I don't know. Maybe, maybe, like, I would maybe try to start the barn on fire, right? What? Knock it down. Sure, sure. Why not? I, I mean, they could try anything. It really doesn't matter because they don't know what's happening. They're just gonna go look around the barn. The barn. They think if they pass through the door of the barn, it will have an interior. Can like throw a right Molotov in there. This is just like Scooby Doo. They have to investigate Mr. No. Before we find out this whole thing that's just deployed by old Farmer Brown. <laughs> Get people to go to his gas station. He's, <laughs> he's, he's trying to scare people away from his gas station. He's trying to sell the, the most Buy it this person's 35th birthday party. <laughs> I'm gonna sue you for misinformation. Already a better movie. Oh. Have our two new characters?
ever said anything. No, they're just here. They're just there. <laughs> they're, they're, they're literally, they're just here because the, halfway through the movie decided it needed more bodies. Well, I hope one of them doesn't get their head squeezed by a cow skull. Oh my god, that's a cow skull. Oh no, it's how gonna did, happen, isn't it? How did you know, Jay? <laughs> Typical a goat. What is that? Yes. A cow. But they didn't have a large. Person. How do you have all these answers? <laughs> Are you just? It's an altar to the devil. Speculating, Rich. It's just horrible. Baseless speculation. Yes. Rich was a part of the production. But there is something. Hanging out with Lou Diamond Phillips behind the camera. Right. Oh, she said something. She's very. No, she's lured it's into it's the, the, the the satanic that's a penis. gets in her mouth and she's like <laughs> like spitting it out like you'd really oh, be doing that if your head was being crushed <laughs> you know what i mean like that sort of like oh gross what that sort of that instinct turns off when your skull's being crushed it's it's just a game magicians uh, are the magician some magic so. now some demonic magic so like a uh, variation of one of their magic tricks from earlier <laughs> Jacket, but it's just a skeleton or something. It's like a raven. But you're dead. Oh. Pecking their eyes hey, there you go. What's oh, already dead? dead. You didn't even yeah, slap yeah. him with anything. You see, even the basic amount of creativity what? just <laughs> See right falls there. Out of I have to blow well, you. Why even introduce the psychic the slap? Yes. <laughs> I guess he's a ma <laughs> magician. <laughs> Ooh, that's good. <laughs> What's that, fucking Harry Potter one? Expect the Patronum! He goes back into the cabin. goes back into the cabin. Jay, that is great. That just saved them $50,000. That was a dagger. Oh. <laughs> God, where's Willie? He must still be in the barn. Those are their new friends. And that's her boyfriend. Why does he always look like he's cringing? <laughs> Oh shit, she's back. You killed me. She's a two scene. She just shows up halfway through the movie. And then she dies right away. Well, she had to get blood on her head. That was probably mildly inconvenient. You all scream in hell tonight. All of you cry. <laughs> but yeah, we don't even need to keep talking, do we? Let's let the movie play out. Oh shit! And all the zombies are the demons. Get ready. Out of the barn. Now? Yes. They, they stirred up the hornet's nest. You know? Shouldn't have gone in that barn, right, Rich? What do you think happened? Why weren't the Z D these demons in there? Now what's happening? I'm writing this. There would be, like, like some kind of spell or something that would be trying They can't reach us! Are you sure? Maybe they yeah. made it, you know, <laughs> sacrifice. Be sure. Yeah. Yeah, now what? Yeah, now what? Something our heroes need to stop. Yeah, 
spell once the spell is completed. The same comes off the, the, the that's how that portal to hell. So sure. Filler? filler? Here, take this. I'm going to check this Because this is filler. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not bad. There, see, I did it. Good luck to you, too. professional joke maker. Right? <laughs> I just had to work that out. It, it took a lot of effort. <laughs> <laughs> Can I sing that little bit? Because this is filler. Right? Without... Like, you can probably get away with that. Okay. okay. And it's parody. Yeah. It's par I'm protected under parody clause. 3189 of the U.S. Constitution. <laughs> this, this is filler. <laughs> it's a filler night. Okay, so Grandma cast a spell, some kind of spell of protection on the ruins of the house, and then the protection spell worked until it stopped. Many demons, maybe? Okay. The to spell knows answer. how many demons are out there? The, the spell only worked for like five demons. Like maybe eight or twelve came out. It's an sixty-year-old spell. Okay. That's just some so very bad timing for our characters then. <laughs> it was just like the last day that it was still valid. <laughs> the spell is good for fifty-nine quarter years. Well, that's what our character gets when we crash. We could have done this at any time during his life. We could investigate this cabin. Well, actually, no, Jay, that's wrong. Oh, oh. He decided to look his father up for no reason after 20 years. Okay. Then his father killed himself, and after his father killed himself, where did they go? He had heard a voice. I don't know. In his head that said, You have to go. Maybe they're and still afraid of the house. The grandparents cabin. Mm. Perhaps that voice was demonic in nature. So um, you quick peek outside. He was, he was lured. Oh. After, only after his father died. I was being sarcastic. You're missing really the basics. Are you saying we're not currently watching your next We are not. Despite all the aliens. Nailed it. Science fiction aliens. <laughs> we are indeed watching a horror picture. Called Satan Farts. Or maybe it's a comedy, I'm not sure. <laughs> maybe that's the problem. When, when, when Alex Kurtzman was researching Star Trek, because yeah. he just got hired to write for Star Trek, instead of watching it on TNG, he accidentally was making a copy of the Demon. Right. <laughs> the yeah. Star Trek, the yeah. next generation. He's watching this. Well, I guess this is Star Trek. Lots of guns. <laughs> Violence. He's so... And the plot can't make any sense. Well, they kind of look like that Incredible. guy on the Star Trek ship. The tall guy. Wharf. He's writing notes. I was waiting for Spot the one that does the magic? Ah, uh, hell no. Jack. Jack, it's funny. Please help. Bunny, help me! That turns him into a demon. It does. Well, that's that's a new piece of lore we've been introduced. Please to. help it's, it's, me, Jack. It's, again, you know, Jack. lots of hybridization going on. Please, Jack. Zombies. Bunny. Religion. Help me, please. No. Jack. It's a bait.
Time, they really should have been learning how to really reading that diary. Yes, that a lot of stuff. It seems to have a lot of information. It's used at the end of the movie. It's like, it's like, then they start Jack? using it as. Uh, I wonder if it was a complete afterthought. What? Were the scenes with the book tacked on later? The whole ending? <laughs> I don't know. When they realized they had no way how to conclude the story? Yeah. Using the same property. <laughs> That's what I said already. Sanitize them. Not you. It's a shadow. Daniel Radcliffe's gonna be really upset. <laughs> Jack, we can fight this. I can help make it so sweet. Fun fact with the close up, that was the hands of the director. He felt he had to have a like, He, he was exactly. the only one who knew the, the, the actions that needed sure. to be performed for the scene to there's, yeah. a, there's a special way that a demon would grow breasts without permission, right? <laughs> and, and this actor just wasn't what? wasn't doing it right. <laughs> just, 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 Step through the eye. You're too late. Is there. that a sperm? Okay, that was a thumb. I don't know what I just saw. <laughs> he, tur he turned into his normal self, then an eight-year-old, then an infant, then a dove. Yeah. I mean, I mean, seen in like DH, I guess, kind of is something. But we all start off as doves. But why? Why do right. I? <laughs> I don't know. Jack, I don't know. I saw a school. Why start reading okay, grandmother's book. Let's start figuring out what's in that book. Seems like it could have some important information. Why did I watch it for two times? She tried to figure it out. Does it make any more sense this time so far? No. So when this is over, should we just go back out into the lobby and buy another ticket? I'm just gonna keep watching it until it makes sense. Yeah, this is the worst trip to a demonic I'm sorry. I'm not. Wait, those aren't demonic zombies. They're just You're not sorry? Walmart. So they use both the daggers now. Yeah. I have and arrived the daggers are my gone. children. Wait, what happened Gather the now. I'm they just, my like, sheep. Yeah, they died. Off camera? Is it the, the petrol girl, station guy? I bet it is. Oh, that was her. The, the, right. yeah. the cow skull. I, I think she just reward. slashed him. Oh. Or she and, and then she attacked him in the barn. Then she appeared later. Happy birthday! Uh, oh shit! It oh, is. No. At some point, she cut no, his head off. Finally, no, twenty-eight. So Long have I waited. <sighs> Thank you, chat. Well, Our better way time than to watch is at hand. <laughs> With you. Gather now, for the time has come. I bring you greetings from the Shadow Father. Okay. Yes, my children, come okay. to me. I guess, maybe. Oh, so, so, my good. children, at last have we gathered. I told you it was there. Enough I already knew it was him. And he's brought fish burgers forever. I'm so wise now that I'm old. <laughs> and why are they sucking the priest's dick? Shouldn't it be the other way around? Yeah, he might be Anders. Oh, no, it's 
body again. Wait, Poor she's body. fine. Check the body. Oh, God, oh, so all the demons coalesce and turn into Bonnie. So that the son of Satan. Yeah, she really can't catch a fucking break. Turn into a doll. Blown up. Revived. Into fucking. What the fuck? Happy birthday, Mr. Forcefield's birthday, man. Hope you have a good birthday. Keep being the God Gamer, the Don Tamer, the RNG and UI Blemmer, the Ass Grabber, the face of Twitch. 45 years old and still going strong. And now is this Anders that has turned into Satan? We gotta try it! I think Anders gave his, his mortal body up to the son of Satan to possess him. Oh, okay. But the son of Satan is so very gross that... I have waited long for this night, Corey like Harmon. <laughs> a fish burger. A burnt up fish burger. <laughs> I, I, don't, I really don't know. He looks like a cancerous orc. Yeah, from Lord of the Rings. I love you. Uh, Feels birthday man clap happy 40 teach. Jesus, Phil's birthday man donates a hundred dollars. My man, now I can uh, maybe buy some. I don't know, fucking Avatar 2 movie tickets. Just wash this dick out of my mouth. Thank you. He's trying to do all the things. Very like, generous, you know, sir. Two months he's got left to live. All he has to do, all the things he wanted to do with his work life. <laughs> That's good. Oh yes, he he's wearing the clothes of Enders okay. or Harcourt, whoever it might be, and it's all ripped apart. So yes, I will be done. Cocaine. Uh, cocaine. Screenwriter's best friend. <laughs> What the what? fuck? What? He's an alien? Oh my god. This is an alien nation. She turned into a Thermian from Galaxy yes. Quest. They did her no good. I took her as a damn bird. Did we know he could do this? And now you're gonna pay for that. Pay out of your pocket and throw it on a light <laughs> candle, Jay. Anything could happen. What the fuck? Just kick the son of Satan. I wish they would explain what the fuck you turn into. Because I can't hear the actual fucking dialogue. Just kick him in the chest. Kicked in the balls, and then after that, move on to other things. Is there any context explaining why Cory looks like Thermian? No. I've speculated in the past that he is a special angel. Because he's got like weird ears. There's some good dialogue in there establishing that this is a possibility. Hinting that this might happen. Please, God. It should be explained, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna agree with you there. What, what's happening should be explained. Right? I don't think it's that deep. It's the incarnation of the angel. Something. It's something. It says here, when we read these three lines, you can inhabit the body of the angel, which will allow you to do battle with the son of Satan. Can I be turned back into my normal self after? I don't know. It's a risk we're gonna have to take. Fair to this movie, nothing like this happens in the Evil Dead. No. No, nobody turns into an alien. <laughs> So, yeah, he's uh, impervious to being attacked. What? Oh, he's coming it was around. just a dream. Thank God, Corey, I couldn't find your pulse. Oh my God, it was all a dream, everybody. Bro, I'm literally this guy. Yeah, you get hey, this guy. Maggie, Maggie Mai with the five gifted. Thank you very much. Is it really? Corey, are you all right? Yeah. Has it's just all a dream movie. ever been <laughs> satisfied? Ever. Where am I? We're at your grandparents' farm. Remember we drove Wizard up here? Wizard of Oz? A Wizard of Oz, it might not really all have been a dream. Yes. It could have theoretically happened. What happened to me? We walked in the front door, looked around, uh, and he just went out like a light. Inception? Man, you hit the floor so hard, it's like you got belted by Mike Is it Tyson. all a dream in Inception? I don't know. I don't remember anything about that. Jack! <laughs> Jack, you're all right! Rich. You're all alive! Only Burn cares about this. Harry Potter. It's just like real life. Why is it just I reject your hypothesis. 
Oops. I reject your reality and substitute my own. Surprise! <laughs> oh no, it's not a dream. She's, she's Corey's girlfriend and we're supposed to care. Oh, wait, what wait, the wait, fuck is that? Yeah. Yeah. It was an illusion. Hey, right send there with the ten gifted. Thank you, man. That's so fucking weird. Although I didn't keep the illusion. Congratulations to the lucky ones. I always loved yeah. you, so Corey. Weird. It was so that no, Satan Dad. could turn Elaine Don't. into a demon and make her his demon bride. But Corey woke up. And interfered and turned her Bro, Inception ending ain't event. got shit on this one. Aren't you following along? Is this a cameo by the director? Oh. Stop, stop it, guys. Stop it. Look at the footage. It's the producer. <laughs> invested all this money. <laughs> but he can't hurt Corey because it's just a memory, it and won't Corey work. is now. I'm not a afraid of you. Monster man. A monster uh, alien angel. Here's one who's terrified. I fear nothing from you. Taking you back to my spaceship. Another life. Son of, son You're of terrified Satan. of us because we're alive. We can feel. You're only a shadow. I will say you I don't hate your cheap the makeup. magic tricks because you're dead. Oh, the makeup's a good. Uh, God uh, changed you into a Satan snake guy. and a chicken shit at the gross. same time. I don't need like magic to protect your soul. Oh my god, um, not the gourd, uh, the gourd fell off. <laughs> that sink just went makeup. fucking Jenga. It looked like a 30 and was a weird choice. Yeah. I, 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 Especially I, since we don't know what he's actually supposed to be. I was gonna say, uh, yeah, yeah, I would, I would offer suggestions of how they could have done it differently, but I don't know what he's supposed to be. Like Aquaman. On Babylon 5 and not in a horror movie. He's got angel in his blood. Corey, but if they're going, are they going angels. for an, uh, an angel? Corey? No, I made that up, but it makes sense. That's how you become an angel. Oh my lord. Neo. <laughs> Get the diary. Read the last spell. Uh, which one's the last spell? I don't know. Just read anything. The one Some, on the back page. Something on it. We call upon the power of light. But the demons Drive also the have kind of control. Send it back into the through. darkness from where it like, came. I'm going to go. He's the, the opposite of, of a demon. Which oh, is this abomination. Cleanse it from my blister. Like, no. Once you came, you shall remain until you are complete again. No! That's right, gifted Ted. Uh, come on, bro, with the five gifted. Boom, boom. You're Yona, five gifted. It's a fucking party in the USA. Oh, thank you, thank you. Ladies, boys. Happy birthday, dear Sebastian. Oh, happy birthday to you. Gratis for the synergy. That means he will sing to the baby. Oh, see you in Laplanta. Bye bye. Thank you very much for the gifted sense as well. God is the cafe owner. Oh. And there's all the other leapers there, and they're basically like angels. Huh. That fly about through time and fix problems. So, are all of their friends burning in hell now? Yes. Corey feels really But at least bad he went on his quest. <laughs> like, that sucks. 
But you know, they made it, right? They Ugh. made it. And that's all that really matters. I understand why he watched this 14 times. That's our cult classic, man. And he kind of found out what happened to his grandparents. Oh, you're human again. So he feels, he feels, <laughs> you know, satisfied. Is it over? Is it really over? I don't even know if it started. <laughs> it was a little bit confusing, honestly. <laughs> Especially towards the end there. Yeah. You just got all your friends killed, Corey. You did it. We need to talk about a relationship, Corey. <laughs> <laughs> I think I, I think it's best we both move on from each other. <laughs> so should we tell all of our friends' parents what happened? <laughs> should we explain this to the police? <laughs> what a prick! <laughs> Why is he laughing fucking laughing? And, laughing? And, and everyone's dead that he invited. To go on this thing, it's not like it was a like a group decision to go on this trip to a cabin in the woods, you know. Maybe, maybe they weren't his friends. Maybe they were all her friends. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no yeah, no <laughs> oh, let's here. Let's Delete the vaults. Let's go to the place that was owned by the man who was the son of the demon. Not friends, peppy hands. Not friends, peppy hands. Anyways, happy birthday, Forson. Here's to the God Gamer. Thank you. Although she wasn't. Dun dun dun. She got to live at the gas station. They they defeated all the demons except they didn't. She was aligned with hard hardcore, who may have been Amherst. But see, now the book, they no longer have to cast it. It's just the existence of the book can kill demons now. They can shoot lasers out and send them to quantum leaps. <laughs> <laughs> Why did they go to the gas station in the first place? To, to kill her, because they, yeah, I guess they knew she was a demon. They highly suspected it. Okay. She, she was hanging out with Oh, hardcore. shit. Although, see, they missed Red-Headed Stepchild. They didn't notice this demon. We know that demons are very easy to defeat, so it's not that big of a deal. You just hold a book up at him. I, I guess. And a He-Man laser comes out and zaps them. <laughs> Jesus the fucking nowhere. Christ! It's nice to take they have in the you know, movie. We don't know. You gotta but, get back but. to the adventure, you know? Very much. Uh, let's beat the final boss. And then I need one more crystal for the uh, trolley experiment rift. One more of those. Alright, I'm ready, G. Hey, kid. Looks like we made a pretty good team. It's been quite the journey. <laughs> This might be the end of the line, so make sure you finish up everything you wanted to do before we head back to Earth. You, uh, ready to go? Too bad this movie bugged out. Alright then, you're gonna need Let's Do It. Let's do it! Alright, let's do it! We got this! Let's do it! Let's walk this house back to Earth! Let's do it! Okay, dude, we get it! Let's do it! All right, I'm, here. I'm too scared to look outside. Hey, kid, before you go, come talk to me. I've got one last thing. All right. Once you step out of the house, we're gonna walk away to safety until the deed is done. That means you'll be on your own. No, not alone. The power of Gatlas will be on a, a, at our side. Yeah, no shit. We know that. I'm just, uh, God, it was just a figure of speech, Kenny. Look, our Mantuas is tough. You might not be able to beat him even with Lesdoit. So, if push comes to shove, use this. What is it? A remote atomizer bomb. Intel says Garmantuas has thick skin like armor, but if you can get this inside him somehow, then trigger it remotely? Well, yeah, I know let's it just is say his guts go. should still be easy to fuck up. 
This will blow him up for good. Y you really think we're gonna need that? I don't know. Just don't want you to die. You are happy now? Happy that you forced me to admit I give a shit? Just take it. This thing was hard as hell to find. Thanks, Gene. You know, we, we, we care about you too. Okay, cool. Fuck off. Fuck off. Good luck. Hey, thank you for the two years, Eco 35. Two yields for some thunder. Give me a fist, William. What the God fuck? Damn, Good thing we got him fixed up, huh? Oh, fuck, he's strong. I'm glad he's on our side. Let's wow, let's do it. You're so powerful. Let's it's really impressive. Has everyone else seen this? You guys gotta see this. He is really powerful. Fucking pretty obvious where Garmantuous is, that giant fucking mega warp base in the distance. Let's do it. Oh hey, fuck. Oh. Let's do it. Why do I have this giant ass fucking square? Oh shit, it's the bounty hunter. This armor. Let's do God, I got hit by some fucking spinning shit. I didn't see. Let's do it. Please don't put me all the way back. I made one mistake. Alright, we're fine. Cool. 
you saved a bunch of galleons. You, uh, you're about to, to dismantle. Let's do it. Do it. That's impressive. That's pretty fucking cool. So that's that, that's all I wanted to say. Uh, that's a team trap on Pluto. Real one line is for me. Bye bye. I love ya. Let's do it! Me and Sylvester Stallone against the world. No bug! crystals in here. We can. Una mas. Gracias.
<laughs> Not bad, huh? Old Gus still got it! I'm happy to serve you! Please tell me how I can help! I love you so much! I'm just glad I can help, too! Not as handy as this motherfucker. Brace yourself. Shit, this is it. It's him. <laughs> I can see his pins. So, welcome to my I told you you don't have a chance against you. You're gonna fucking die. I'm really fucking strong. And you will with all my men. You fuck with my operation. You trespass upon my territory. So you understand why I'm going to fucking kill you, right? Is it clear? Well, listen, I understand what you're saying here, but... Stand your ground. We're gonna fucking kill you, Garbantuan. Let me see. Fucking fuck! I only have one dash! <laughs> Shit, now's our chance. We have to shove that bomb inside of him. Uh, let's do it. Uh, let's do it. Yes, okay, deep, a little deeper. There we go. Okay, yeah, shove that bomb all the way up his asshole into his intent or whatever's up there. Okay, that should be good. Now pull out and let's blow this fucker up. It's time for the G3 to become the G0. Suck my ass. 
What's wrong? Is, 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 is it broken? God damn it, Gene, the remote's busted? Oh, shit. Oh, hello. You're fucking done. Now it's time to make you really suffer. Fuck. Let's make a deal. If you give up and turn yourself over to me, then I won't harm the two people you love most in this world. Fuck, he's got your parents. Behold! Uh, hey, it's me, Jack Black. Hi. Oh, Jack Black. I'm Susan Sarandon. just talking about you. Do, do we know you? Huh? Are, are those your parents? Parents? What, what the fuck are you talking about? I don't think the bounty hunter even knows these people. Yeah, we don't. But it's so nice to meet you. So what? You don't love these two? Because every human I ask said they loved him. Well, yeah, everyone uh, loves us. Everyone I'm loves sorry, Jack County Black. Fire. I don't know sure about her. She's fine, you know? I guess. They're alive. I, I, I can feel it. Oh. <laughs> okay, Bounty Hunter. Enough fucking around. Let's finish this. <laughs> You're delusional. And you're going to stop me. <laughs> on the floor I can't stand anywhere God bro I cannot stand anywhere and I cannot look down because I have to look at the fucking what the fuck Asshole, and I'll detonate it manually. Oh, that's not good. Kenny, that would mean. Yeah, I know. Kenny, we're not letting you do that, okay? There's gotta be another way. Can you think of anything? Actually, no, I can't. I guess this is the only way. You're gonna blow both yourselves up? Kenny, you might die. I, I know. Hey, bounty hunter, fighting alongside you has been, well, it's been the best thing that's ever happened to me. Thank you for giving me the adventure of a lifetime. Now shove me deep inside that monster slug's dirty asshole. Kenny! I want to do this. I, I need to do this. Okay. All right. Here we okay. go. Okay. Well, I guess this is goodbye. You're the best bounty hunter I've ever seen. And you're an even better friend. 
See you later, pal. I'll always be with you, and I love you. Oh, 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 shit is done. Come out to us, is dead. He's fucking dead. Rest in peace, fucker. Oh, Good my work, God, they hunter. killed Kenny. What about? There's no way you he could survive that. What a noble sacrifice. I can't believe it. No fucking way. Oh, my God, they survived. They made it. Let's do it. I'm not touching this. I'm, the I'm alive. Is Garmantuous dead? We owe you big time. The whole universe owes you. Now you're a fucking hero. I'm so glad you made it. We did it. Uh, the... Okay. I'm not gonna lie. I was expecting something better at... The ending. Uh, the, never mind the glitching. I don't have that. That's just an OBS thing because it fucks with the game sometimes when you have game capture. Uh, but uh, overall, this was a pretty good game. I mean, the shooting part was shit, but uh, I enjoyed the the rest of it. Rick and Morty, uh, the game, I would say, much better than the first game of Rick and Morty, right? Uh, in my opinion. Um, good, good stuff, good shit developers, good shit, good shit, good shit, good shit. Carried by Rick and Morty writers, but you know, uh, that's yeah, so good, uh, that's what I paid for, that's what I paid for, man. Uh, lots of bugs, yeah, but uh, didn't mind it too much. Still two movies left. Yeah, but not today, alright. I am fucking tired as shit, alright. I went up early to fuck your mom today. And it's killing my body right now. My neck is like stiffening up and shit. So, uh, I'm gonna peace for today, alright. Oh shit, flying in my eye. The fuck, I can't see. Oh, secret ending. Alright, here you go. Hold to skip, they said. I forgot what key this is. What is that key in the bottom right? I feel like I should know, but I don't know. Backspace. I just pressed it twice by mistake because my reactions were so slow at the fact that I already pressed it once. And then someone said backspace and I pressed it. But, uh, nice. Very nice. Uh, very unlucky. It's fine. We'll uh, we'll find out one day. Macfin the cat. Two years. Thank you, man. Keep joke. Keep. Muchas gracias. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for the subs, resubs, gifted subs, ton of gifted subs. Uh, social credits. I'll see you tomorrow.